Edison is also live, Pog. Hi, Boo. Good morning. I'm drinking my coffee. Hello, everybody. Um, hello, Snowflake. Hi, Rexazoid. Hi, George. Hi, Lauren Miles 21. Hello, Hannah K. Fitton. Hey, Plebsley. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Zachary. The stream is starting soon. Yesterday, I watched Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, but only the first half of it. The first 49 minutes to be exact. How many are there? 36, counted them myself. <laughs> um, I realize there's another scene that can I can also do kind of well. It's the one from, um, it's the one where, um, where Ron's on the bus and goes, my brother, my brother George taught me a, taught me a spell. Want to see it? And then he goes, ah, 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 ah. son. And then her body comes in and says, has anyone seen a toad? <laughs> a boy named Neville's last one. Oh, are you doing magic? Let's see then. <clears throat> Sunshine, daisies, butter, mellow. Turn this stupid fat rat yellow. And it doesn't work on the scabbard. Because guess what? He's not actually a rat. It's Peter Pettigrew. Pog. Oh, come on. This movie's like 20 years old. I can spoil it now. Anyway, then she goes, okay, and then it gets a bit fuzzy and then, and then it gets a bit fuzzy. But then after that, Hermione's like, Oculus Reparo. And then, uh, that's all I remember. And then, and then fast forward, fast forward, fast forward. And then, oh, my brain. I need coffee. Get on in. Is that a real spell? Yes. Yes, that's the spell that Hermione uses on Harry to fix his glasses, the tape. And then it's like, and then he like takes off his glasses, it's like fixed. And then um, after they get sorted into their houses, Percy takes them up to their dorm room and then they're at the front door and then the lady goes, password. <laughs> and then he goes, Capit Draconis. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I love Harry Potter. There's like a few movies I'm super, super annoying to watch movies with. Super annoying. And Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, I am t I am so annoying. I will not stop like repeating the lines with them. I'll pause, I pause the movie to like tell Edison what the next line is. And he's like, I don't care. <laughs> that movie and Mean Girls and I think, what else? Those two are like really funny. <laughs> yeah, I love them. Oh, High School Musical. I'm pretty, I'm, I'm more annoying because of the music though. Like I just sing the songs. One day uh, we should do a movie night that's like Harry Potter, but then I open mic, I, I get open mic and I get to be like super, like I can say whatever I want the whole time. And you can like deafen me, I suppose. That'd be really funny, I think. It would definitely ruin your experience. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to stop. I wouldn't be able to stop myself. You're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? 
a wizard and a oh, I forgot what he says after there's a line I can't say I don't remember and then you ever you ever make anything happen anything oh you make you ever make anything st strange happen anything you couldn't explain when you were angry or scared and he goes ah and then and then and then and then, and then Vernon Uncle Vernon's like I will not pay to have some crackpot old fool teach him magic tricks. Okay. <laughs> Need more coffee. <laughs> Can we learn how to change your eye color today? No. That is advanced Photoshop. Today we are going over the basics. Edison is a real beginner, okay? Peter knows a bit more, but Edison is brand new to Photoshop, so we can't go that advanced yet. Uh, we will be doing the basics, basics of Photoshop. How to import a photo how to crop uh you know like crop the outside of i don't even know how to say it. you know when you like have an outline of like you draw a face or something you need to like delete the outside of it you like outline it i don't even know how like what the word is for that um KT Bugs thank you for the five months flunder thank you for the three months grace bees with the sub anton thank you for the twitch prime 12 cock 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 um, think of it two months. Anthony with the 500 bit says, I once used a photo editing program to combine a female deer and a stinging bug. It was Adobe. How long did it take you to come up with that joke? All right, everybody. Are we ready? Are we ready? All right. It's time. It is time. Dun, 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 dun. Um, my kids and thank you for three months. And I can't yeah. say the guy's name before. It's because it's kind of inappropriate. But thank you for the two months. I appreciate that. Hello, everybody. And welcome to... Oh my gosh, my hair is so scuffed today. Even you guys can see this, right? What is this? And what is this? Looks like a tornado. <laughs> Spread that out. Okay. Um, it does. It's like a. <laughs> yeah, you guys saw that stinger transition. I made it. No, I didn't. <laughs> they gave it to me. But, you know, in Adobe and uh, using the Creative Cloud products, you can mm -hmm. learn how to make that yourself. Steph, thank you for the four yeah, months. Okay, Welcome okay. back forward to the Feasley family. Hello, everybody. Slav, thank you for the four months. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Um, and God, my hair's so bad. Okay, whatever. Um, hello. Uh, I suck at Photoshop, and so I should watch this today. Yeah, I mean, yeah. This, this is definitely if you're if you're good at Photoshop, which I know a lot of you guys are actually pretty good. Uh, this you you won't learn much, but um, if you're like brand new, this is a uh, you learn something for sure like i i'm kind of i mean i'm like i'm 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 good <laughs> i'm pretty good i mean i know the basics the basics <laughs> but last time i was doing this i know a lot of you guys were like that's not how you do it <laughs> i'm like okay then you teach <laughs> hey queen i wish you and edison the best photoshop session Mwah. kiss and peter Thanks, Lucas, same for the four months. Yeah, today I'm going to be teaching the Park Brothers how to use a little bit of Adobe. Um, so it's pretty exciting. We'll be starting in one minute. Stephanie, thank you for the sub. Pam Ramirez, thank you for the sub. Lucas, thank you for the four months. Welcome, 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 welcome back. Hello. Oh, also, um, mods. Sorry, I have a favor. At 110, can you guys help me start a squad stream with Peter and Edison? Not that I don't know how to do a squad stream it's just that i i know how to do it it's just that i have it's just you know that's something cool i thought maybe you would want to do <laughs> so peter and edison are waiting i told them that i would send out the request okay hello everybody today's stream is sponsored by adobe <laughs> 
uh, the Adobe Creative Cloud. Um, Hi, here's fun. I'm personally, this is a really cool sponsorship for me because I've been a big fan of Adobe products since I was a kid. I'm, I even have a Photoshop tutorial up on YouTube, but we don't need to talk about that one. But I have, I do, I am a really big fan of Adobe and I actually open Adobe Photoshop and Premiere probably at least. I open Photoshop probably every other day um, and then Premiere like whenever I do basic edits. I'm not a much of a Premiere whiz, but I do know like I have like short keyboard shortcuts. I watch tutorials. I can do fade outs and, and do, I can do, I can do some editing on Premiere. I'm not like, I'm no Broden, but I can do, I can do some stuff. Okay. So, um, anyways, I'm here to talk to you guys about the Adobe Creative Cloud and their Creative Cloud All Apps Plan, which is 60% off always, always 60% off for students at adobe.com slash students. I know a lot of you guys are students, so if you are a student, 60% off always uh the creative cloud has all the apps you guys need to stand out as a content creator on twitch if you if that's what you want to do like um e even if you're not a content creator there's a lot of amazing things you can do but specifically like for someone like me or any streamer starting out sometimes you don't want to pay like uh, 60 to 100 dollars for an emote which they can be really expensive um and if you have like a really basic idea for an emote uh you can literally just draw it yourself and uh which we'll go over and like make it yourself and just resize it um but a lot of people like at least at first it's just like i don't know how to make an email i don't know how to resize that i don't know like the basics of that i'll just have somebody do it but this is like really really easy stuff so i will go over that today we will be teaching edison and peter they are my students um also <clears throat> Yes, uh, the power of creativity to impact content creation and gaming is unleashed with Creative Cloud. Creative Cloud apps like Photoshop aren't just for designers or influencers. They are for anyone who wants to take their future into their hands and stand out from the crowd. They're Thanks for, for the all crew. Oh, no problem. They're for all creators, no matter where you are in your creative journey. You guys can type exclamation point Adobe into the chat to get a link to purchase if you're a student. <sighs> I'm a film student. I use Adobe all the time. I, I'm sure many of you guys are really, really familiar with Adobe. It's, it's like, it feels like a very necessary tool. As soon as you start like diving into like any kind of create, creative content creation, I use, um, personally, I use uh, Photoshop, Premiere, and Lightroom. Um, I love Lightroom. They have a Lightroom app thing. I also use uh, like, is it Edge? There's like, it's like. It's like their shortened oh, version like of out. Rush. It's called Rush. Um, on my phone to like edit short videos. There's like so many little things. Um, they're like drawing one on the iPad. Um, it's very like, at least at, initially it feels very basic and then you dive in and then it's like really complex. Um, obviously I don't, I'm not like a pro, you know, so I don't know all the complex stuff, but you can do some insane things in Photoshop and Premiere and it's just, yeah. So if, uh, if you guys are interested in learning today, I will be teaching some basics. V Sakura, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub, by the way, at CT Holmes, thank you for the 25 months. <sighs> all right. Oh, wow. Hello. I, uh, did Edison hear me on his side? <laughs> Hello! Leslie. Hello, finance. Hello, finance. Okay, I just want to make sure you have Adobe installed. <laughs> you did that. Oh, uh, no. Oh. Wait, I, I need to have it installed? Um, oh. I thought you were going to teach me how to install the program. Peter. Oh. Peter. Haven't you ever heard about the power of creativity and how it's unleashed with the creative cloud? How could you not have this installed in your computer? I'm sorry. I was born in a world without creativity, and thus I am here to learn from the best teacher of all time, Foosley. That's me. Today, we're going to be learning some of the basics. But you guys need to have Adobe installed, uh, for real. You guys have it, right? No, no. Yeah, we have it. Don't worry. I have Photoshop installed, for sure, which is what we're using today, correct? Correct. Correct. Okay, Correct. that pause kind of was terrifying. No, 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 uh, no, 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 no. It's because oh. it's because Sock was he was on me, and then I couldn't uh, had to put him Got down. Got it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, so also, Professor, I think we're supposed to start squad stream before we get swing into this. Is that correct? Correct. Correct. Uh, um, yes. Correct, Amundo. Um, mods, 
you will be receiving an invitation ne uh, a couple minutes uh, now. It's already there. All right, it looks like my mods are already on the case. I'm ready. Edison, uh, did you get okay. the squad stream um, invite? Invitation. Um, yes, invitation uh, he happening shortly. He doesn't know how to do it. You don't know uh, how to do it. Looking for it. Push seven. He doesn't know how to do it. Start squad stream. MP, thank you for 26 uh, months. MDN, thank you for five wait, months. You, no, no, no. Crowd wizard, Did thank you for Twitch Prime. Invitation. Can you send it again? Um, uh, uh, I guess. I had an invitation like really quickly. Wait, Leslie's way too dank. Uh, oh. Oh, hold on. Let me fix that. No, how no, no. Now? It might how be on now? my end. Is that better? Is this better? How about now? Testing, uh, testing. Oh, thanks. Okay, Edison, I think you're good. I, am I in the squad stream, guys? Am I? Um, yes, you are. I think I'm you're good. At it. I'm, I'm right, but I don't want to be it's... part of the squad stream. All right, kick him, Leslie. We need to find someone else. Kick him! Yeah. You know how many people are in line for this class, Edison? How yes, many people want to learn? Class. You know how many people want to be in this two-person class? Yeah. How many people have seen my Photoshop tutorials on the internet and are just dying to learn Photoshop from me? Wait, is that why Adobe reached out to you? Did they see that YouTube video of your No, 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 no. Wait, are I they literally so dying? Grow. Like, figure of speech dying or like literal dying? Leslie is literally killing people so that Wait, they can fight I'm going to be honest. I could believe that. I could believe that. <laughs> All right. So anyways, moving on. Hello, everybody. You're welcome to our Adobe stream. We are going oh. to be diving into the creative cloud. I have two students with me, Peter Park and Edison Park. Uh, and wow. hello. Would you guys like to introduce yourselves? Uh, hi, uh, my name is uh, Peter. I am Leslie's number one student, and we are gonna be uh, what we're gonna I'm gonna be pogging when I make these emails today, right? Peter, right, professor. Peter, Peter. That's exactly what I sounded like when I was a teenager. I believe it. Are you making fun of me? Yes. All right, Edison, please. Um, what's oh oh? Um, can you guys talk about your experiences with Photoshop so far? Like how much you guys have Hello? actually used? Hello, you didn't give me a chance to introduce myself. Oh, sure. Ooh. Sorry. Introduce yourself, Ooh. and then talk Ooh. about your personal uh, your knowledge of Creative Cloud or any of the yeah, products of um, Adobe Creative hi, Cloud. Hi, my name's Edison, and I'm recently single. What? <laughs> oh, hey, check your DMs, buddy. <laughs> We're literally engaged. Oh, Edison. hey, Peter, are you still single? <laughs> okay. I've been single for 29 years. <laughs> Talk about well, we your experience with Adobe. <laughs> well, well, Peter, I'm about to math. learn some uh, dank Adobe skillage. Let me write you a little, uh, a little love. Uh, oh yeah, you're gonna yeah, make me yeah. a little bit of a I, nice I've always card. wanted to get creative with my love note writing skills. We're on the front page of well, Twitch. This is the perfect time. Keep it professional. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I'm not on the front page of Twitch. I'm on the front page. I'm not. Yes, Paul but I am. You're holding Leslie hostage <laughs> on the front page of Twitch. Okay, so you guys want to talk about your experiences with Adobe? Uh, you know, Creative Cloud. What a like actual experience. So I know, you know, what level you guys are starting from and how much I need to hold your hand. Oh, I've been I've been using Photoshop since uh, high school, I think. Oh. Um, it, like I remember I used it. What was it? I think my my the first time I actually used it was when I was part of high school my high school journalism class, oh. and I was I was responsible for like art and graphics and stuff. So like I would just like do freehand drawings, uh, on, on using Photoshop. Peter might be better like, than all me. All my Photoshop experiences all um self taught or like with YouTube videos. I never really took a class for it, but uh yeah I, I've I've used Photoshop for a really long time. I actually think that you might be more fit to teach this, but you know what? I will do my best to teach you something no, no, new. No, 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 no. Well, listen, I I suffered from a, a, a very uh, medium concussion, and I forgot almost all my memories from anything from three years or before. Oh, perfect. So, so yes, you are the perfect teacher for this. Okay. And Edison, your experience? Zecho. None. I'm sorry, None. I don't speak Nada. French. What was that? Zecho. You've, Zecho. you've never opened Photoshop yourself. We. Oui. If you've needed. Hi. Oh, okay. Well, this is perfect. Si. All right. Yes. So we have two students of varying. Affirmative. Confirmed. I hear you. Roger. I hear. 10-4. Um, so 
Ten four ten four. <laughs> He's new Watch to streaming. Watch operations. <laughs> he hasn't streamed in Are a while. Good to go as planned. <laughs> He's ten four ten four. <laughs> Sorry, Edison's actually an NPC from uh, <laughs> Command and Conquer, and he's uh, clearly just been brought to real life reality, and he doesn't know how to function properly yet. <laughs> 10 4 10 4. Okay, Copy over. That. Over. Okay, so um that's perfect. So you guys are both Twitch streamers and, and content creators, right? Copy that. Right. So Roger. So <laughs> Go photo, go go. Edison. So pretty much today I'm going to be going over three lessons. And in those three lessons, the first one will be how to make a very uh, basic emote, like, you know, maybe a little face that we'll just draw ourselves. And the cool thing is about this after that is that you guys are going to actually upload it to your channels. You guys are all partners in good standing, right? Well, I am as of this moment. Okay, good. So you can instantly upload your emote. And then uh, the second lesson we'll teach is a little bit more advanced where we're going to take a photo and turn it into an emote. And then the third lesson, we're oh. going to be making a panel for the underlay of your Twitch channel that people can click on and maybe go somewhere. How's it sound? Roger, roger. Roger, roger. Affirmative, Houston. Okay, so the format of the lessons is I'm going to teach for 10 minutes then you guys will get a little bit of time to work on it yourselves, and then you will come back and present what you have made. I'm ready. Um, and I will uh, critique qu you. Question, teacher, question. Yes, question. yes, yes. Uh, uh, yes, uh, will you be teaching us how to Photoshop eye colors? That's too advanced for this lesson, but maybe another time. Are you uh, sure? Because I really want to, like, I, I'm too scared yes. to put in colored contacts, so I want to Photoshop colors over my yes, eyes. Yes, actually. So I was thinking, actually, like, maybe, so, like, a nice color of blue. Yeah, well, that's so once I favorite, said is too advanced. So today, one, so and we're focusing on emotes. One of my favorite TV shows of all time ever is uh, Game of Thrones, and I've always been fascinated by White Walkers. They're like yeah. my favorite character. Sure. So White Walkers are these like zombie like creatures. Okay. With like really radiantly blue eyes. Right. <laughs> um, and so like I've always been fascinated by them. Is there any way that you'd be able to teach me how to create a White Walker? I do want to. With the power of Adobe Photoshop, you absolutely can get the White Walker effect. However, that's a bit um, more than what we're focusing on today. Today we're strictly sticking to Twitch related. Uh, you know, uh, content. Oh, well, you don't have time to teach us how to do that. Do you perhaps have, made, have you maybe made a video in the past that could perhaps uh, walk us through uh, changing eye color, eye tone, anything like that? Maybe at some point in a past life, I vaguely remember potentially doing that, but I don't know where that is. So moving on, are we ready? Are there any questions before we start our first lesson? I'm ready. Edison? Uh, sorry, I'm just looking at potential other, um, um, nothing, nothing, uh, nothing. Sorry, go on. What were you saying? I hear a lot of clicking over there, Edison. You, you good? <laughs> All right, Edison, if, you do, uh -huh. if you're doing what I think you're doing, we're well, going to... What do you think I'm doing? <laughs> we're breaking up after this video. Just, Wait, what do you think I'm after doing? After this stream. If you're doing what I think you're doing. <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, Edison, no problem, because I'm single, <laughs> and this is not a problem. <laughs> All right, everyone, please turn your pages to Adobe Photoshop. All right, please uh, open open it up. Open the app. We're going to start our very I first lesson. To buy the Adobe textbook, apparently, which we need. There's no textbook. Page. Just open the app. Oh, app open. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. All right. Ma All right. Okay. Are we ready? Um, everybody. Uh, um, yes, yes. We are ready. We're ready. What's going on? Sorry, I wasn't listening. Edison, open yes. up Adobe, please. So way ahead it, what's of you. it like being single, man? Oh. Way ahead of you. I've had this open for a long time, for at least 30 minutes. All right. So um, everybody, um, also, I have um, my Twitch chat and your Twitch chats all making sure you guys are following along and not um, not uh, get, getting distracted watching other videos. So they will be reporting back to me if you so guys... So you're me you have <laughs> snitches in my chat. Get that cash yes, I have snitches in your chat. So Leslie, you... have I ever told you back in high school what they do to snitches? No, tell us, Peter. What do they, they do to snitches? They give them sn flowers and chocolate. Okay. Well, then right. I don't mind being a snitch. <laughs> because we definitely would never give anyone snitches during a sponsored segment. Yeah, especially get, with snitches get kisses, okay? Exactly, exactly. You guys new to sponsored streams? 
<laughs> why would you ask that? <laughs> Wait, why are you saying it like that? <laughs> All right, everyone. So, <laughs> the first lesson we have on today's agenda. Are you ready? I am ready. Okay. We are going to be learning how to make the most basic of basic emotes. Basic. You would know what basic means. <laughs> okay, Leslie. thanks. Yeah. All right, Starbucks emotes. Let's no, go. No, no, Let's go. no, no. Taylor Swift. No, that's not what I mean. That's not what I mean. That's not what I mean. No, I'm just talking about like basic as in simple. Okay. So the first thing you're gonna do. This is what I like to do. Okay, go to a okay. uh, yeah Photoshop okay. open right. Uh, and if at any yes. point, any time, please pause or you know just let me know that you need to slow Leslie, down. Too fast. Can you say oh, that one more okay. time, please? If at any time I'm moving too quickly through little the lesson. A little uh, bit slower, please. A little, little slower. bit slower. If at any time I'm moving too quickly through the lesson, yeah, just stop me, okay? All right, Perfect. so go to, <laughs> go to file. You guys see file on top left? Yep. File. Yep. Yeah. I clicked file. <laughs> New. New. All right. New. Now, an emote is a square. I mean, like, it's like you want to use, a make. square. Right, Where's so. Square? so what you, is the definition of a square? No, we're not Wait, going that like basic. Square like a rectangle or like a. Um, I believe all rectangles are squares, but not all square. squares are rectangles. All that, rectangles are yeah. squares. That right. doesn't sound right. But Wait, I didn't are you sure all here, so rectangles are squares or are all squares are rectangles? Um, all squares are rectangles, but not all rectangles are squares. Wait, <laughs> why are we talking about this? Width five hundred, height five hundred, create, go. There should be right. a square on your page right now. Oh, hold on, sorry. You're so fast. How many pick? What's the resolution? How many pixels? Okay. Are what, what resolution? Okay. Do I do 300? 500 by 500. Let's start with that. And also for your background context, uh, please pick transparent. Resolution, yeah. Leslie. Resolution. What do you mean resolution? 500 what by resolution? 500. Oh, 500. 500. Uh, oh, oh. What about my pixels per inch? Oh. Uh, oh. Huh? That's a good question. I, I think, just, I think it's 300. I just, oh, okay. 300? Sure. Okay, let's just do that. 300, really? Okay, thank you. I think I remember reading a tutorial to say uh, 300. Okay, okay, good. good. Yeah, so Wait, three. So this is going to be with 500 inches or 500 pixels? Someone pixels. said 72 is fine. So. Yeah, 72 is fine. The default, I just use the default. 500 inches is a lot of inches. Edison, 500 pixels. 300 okay, is too I'm much sorry, for email. I'm sorry. sorry, I lied, Wait, this, Leslie. This I lied. Automatic. Are you sure it's 500 pixels? Okay, 500 pi pixels. Apparently, 72 is fine. I, I, I misled you. My apologies, It's teacher. fine. Okay, uh, then I'll just make a third square. Um, Just that 72 pixels, done. Are we good? Does everyone have a 500 by 500 72 inch resolution <laughs> square Wait, on their res screen? Resolution 72? Yes, you guys have that on your screen. 72 pixels per inch. Yeah. Why why do I have a transparent background? Okay, so the reason you have a transparent background is so that uh because uh let me think about this. Okay. So in some emotes, like you know how it's like you don't want a background on the emote? Like if I just uploaded a square to Twitch, like it'd just be a square. But you see how like most emotes have like, you know, it doesn't look like a square. There's like it's like transparent in the back. <laughs> So that's what we want to set up for is like a, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. So that makes Total sense. sense. That makes yep. a lot yes, of sense. Yes, yes, yes. That makes, it makes sense, sense, right? Okay. I, I understand now why you have a PhD in creativity. Thank yes. you. Yes. All right. Okay. Oh, is that okay. What okay. Hold on. Real, that makes a lot of sense. Yes. Real, real talk though. So 500 by 500 resolution 72. Yes. Correct. And then pixels and pixels per inch. Yes. Okay. Okay, now we're going to make the most basic of basic emotes, okay? And I'm talking like, you know, I don't know how many of you guys were around in 2015 when my first emotes, I drew myself. I made an emote that was literally called Foo's Love and it was a circle with two heart. Actually, even simpler, I had one that was called like Foo's Tilt and it was just like a circle with two eyes and then a... F yeah, it's just like... And I made them and then I think I still have some of them. So you guys are just going to um, make like we're just gonna make a face pretty much and then okay but I'm confused so like what's the stuff on the right over here and then what's the stuff up top and then what's the stuff on the left okay all of these? perfect perfect okay so um on the left side you have your tools you have there's a lot of them we're not gonna go through all of them but there's a one that's like a brush there's one that's like um it lets you select part of the image and move it around there's one that allows you to like move around the whole image there's like an eraser tool a blur tool if you want to like blur something out there's a text tool there is uh, there's a, just a bunch of tools and and we'll use some of them today but there's no way we can go into, there's one uh, the magnifying glass allows you to like zoom in on the entire thing yeah any questions about the tools nope 
Okay, now something very important in Photoshop is actually the layers. So you see on the bottom right, there's a layers with a bunch of layers. Huh? huh? <laughs> uh, Can you explain layers as if I had a concussion? Okay, so layers are, um, you know what layers are in real life, right? Just like layer one, layer two, layer three, layer four. Uh, I know layers of the internet, the seven layers of the internet. Okay, so I know, like, you know, layers like a, on a cake. You know, like at the very top, you have like the protocol layer. Okay, let me like teach you some IP. very basic things. Very, very, very basic. Okay, so, um, do you see any the layer screen? Can any? Oh, oh, I understand. Ogres. Uh, onions are like onions layers that thing. Yeah, oh, sure. Oh, layers no, ogres are like know, onions, wait, and Edison. onions have layers. Edison, you know, like seven layer dip. You know how there's yes. like the, oh, the sour so like cream layer. Dip. There's like wait, the guacamole you're... layer. Wait, are you telling me that... Wait, Photoshop invented bean dip? <laughs> no, Photoshop is like hey! bean dip. Hey! Oh. Class! Like Students! So, for example, you're working on one layer at a time. So, let's imagine like you're making a seven-layer okay. bean dip. So, okay. the bottom okay. layer, right, is like the the, 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 the tom tomato salsa, okay? So, that's the... That, like when you're go digging through bean dip, right? The top okay. layer is the say, layer, layer you'd see first. So, okay. you want like your okay. sour cream on top. So, okay. what, let's, okay. as you're digging through it with that chip, right? You see underneath the sour cream. So, the layer underneath... Like that's how layers work. Okay. And the, so, the, the layer... The top layer uh -huh. is the layer uh -huh. that you'd see first. So, so, so where's you, the avocado? Where's the avocado? The avocado is wherever you want it to be. Okay. You know? So, I want it to be like right below the sour cream because avocado is like my favorite part. So, yeah. That would be... So, many different things. So, the okay. layers in your bottom right are actually in order so the okay. top layer okay. would be the sour cream which would show up as the very topmost layer in your okay. in your layers okay. 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 and the okay. bottom oh layer God. yeah okay bottom layer is the so then what's like in the middle middle oh the cheese we need like the nacho cheese in no, the no. middle yeah the nacho cheese okay. would be in the middle so that you can make that the okay. middle layer yeah okay okay, okay got it got it so um, i'm hungry now i'm hungry hey you uh, want to go get some food this teacher's kind of boring hey I'm, I'm down let's just, let's just watch the webcast <laughs> you seem, afterwards. you seem really interesting you said you were single right <laughs> Yeah, I'm single. Hello, right. You want to just watch the webcast after this and we just get out? <laughs> Guys, I'm yeah. teaching you a lesson. Okay, okay. Oh, shoot, oh, shoot, oh, shoot, she's talking. Yeah, okay. So now um, we're going to be... Okay, so layers, right? So do you guys see the layers um, The layers panel on the right side of your screen anywhere where it says layer one and there's like a square? I don't see any anything called avocado layer. Edison, at this rate... We are not going to finish even the first lesson in time. We only have a two-hour period. Do you see the... Sir, yes, sir. I see the layers tab, sir. Uh, Peter, do you see it? Yes, I do. All right, perfect. Okay, so quick lesson is just make another layer. Go to the top. You see file, edit, image, layer. Go to layer. Go new and layer and make another layer called layer two. Tell me when you're done. Professor, I think you can also click on the little icon on the bottom right that looks like a plus sign inside of a box. I think it gives you a new layer. <laughs> Just do that, too. That's a lot faster. Wait, wait. There's a plus sign. Uh, you can do that. Next That's to the trash can God, icon. It's so efficient. Oh, I see it. Yes, sir. Oh, sir. Yes, sir. Look okay, at that. I, have, yeah. I now have seven layers of bean dip. Oh, sorry. My concussion's back and I've forgotten everything. Okay. No, 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 no. That's actually just much more efficient. Just press the plus sign and you have a new layer. Okay. Now, something really cool is that now when you draw on layer three, for example, take your brush tool and like draw on layer three and then um, it it doesn't affect layer one because they're on different layers. So then you can like erase part of layer three, but you're not touching layer one. Does that concept uh, make sense? Oh yeah. Yeah, right? And you can delete it's like yeah. It's like imagine like you you know that 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 prank where or not that prank, that challenge where you get like saran wrap and you have to eat Oreos on either side. So you guys are like kissing, but you're not. It's like that, right? Sure. <laughs> Never heard of that one, but that that sounds like a good example. Uh, Edison, are you following along with the layers thing? Sir, yes, sir. Okay. So I think what's really cool is I took... Okay, so I wrote some stuff down on layer three. Yeah. And then I wrote some stuff down on layer five. And then... You have five right, layers? <laughs> well, I have seven layers. Okay. I thought oh. we were making bean dip. <laughs> okay, so I wrote some stuff on layer three and wrote some stuff on layer five. And then I flip their ordering so that five is on top of three. And now that five is on yes. top of three, the green actually shows up on top Perfect. of the blue. You guys which get it. The blue is originally from my layer three. So I wanted blue to represent kind of like there is no blue in bean dip. I know, but I was I was envisioning something that would be more like liquefied and liquidy. And the first thing I thought of when I thought of liquid was water. That's why I use the, the color blue. 
right? And then green, I want it to be avocado, but this one is a much more fresh avocado, so it's a very lighter shade of green. Uh, maybe it's more like greens, maybe like arugula or something like that. Exactly. That yes, exactly. Okay, so, cool. So um, pretty much whatever you do on each layer, you can like as long as one's on top, it's like you see that one on top. It just it works like you're making like imagine, you know, like you're writing on a clear, you know, in school, those worksheets that they project onto the board. Like, you know, and you'd write and like be a clear piece of paper and it'd be a it's projection. It's a projector, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the projector. And then they'd put another piece of paper onto it or something. And then it's like a clear one. They can write on it. And then Leslie. What? You just dated yourself. <laughs> okay. So anyway. Do you think, okay, can we, do, do they still use projectors in classes? <laughs> Honestly, probably Is that still not. a thing? Uh, <laughs> I, I think don't, they no. probably just use laptops and okay. Photoshop on the laptops. You're right. Okay. So, uh, erase the last 20 seconds of your memory so let's go back to the layers thing so pretty much um that's just a cool thing to know um and what we're gonna do is we're going to make draw a face on layer one or yeah use as many layers as you'd like you're gonna take the brush tool on the left everyone can find the brush tool right and then uh you're going to uh pick a color edison do you see like the color swatches i know that peter knows how to do this in the top right uh like on the swatches there's yeah, two swatches. Oh, oh, oh there's two squares on the bottom left of uh okay. at the very bottom of the toolbar one of them is like uh a square and the other is a square <laughs> and then they're and they're on top of each oh, other on top of each other yes yeah. I see it. so pick okay, the I one on it. the left it's a four it's it's the color you're if you click it and you change that color and then you click on the brush tool which is uh do you see the brush tool it's the one that looks like a paintbrush huh oh no i mean <laughs> um so do you see the brush tool uh-huh. Okay, I'm so on the brush tool. you're on the brush tool. What happens if you like draw with it on like l the first I layer? I draw more avocado bean dip. What does that mean? I'm drawing on the layer. I'm going to open your stream. You're not communicating with no, me. No, you're not communicating. Okay, perfect, I'm literally perfect. Perfect. trying right now. This is perfect. Calm, this calm, this is good. Calm, this is good. Calm. This is good. This is good. Okay. Yeah. So, um, right. Yours is green. Okay. So, um, what we are going to do is we're going to make an, a face, okay? Just make any kind of expression, maybe one that you're feeling right now, maybe how you felt last night, just a face that you can... Can I, can I do a face, but it's superimposed onto another object and or animal? Sure. You know, since you're more advanced with Photoshop, you can go ahead and do that. As, oh, wait. What, do, what are you asking? Imposed on an animal? Never mind. No, no, no problem. Okay, that's fine. So um, we're gonna make a face, and then what we're gonna do? Uh, oh, oh, actually, one thing. Can we can we all just kind of make a face together uh, first? So like draw a circle together, kind of thing. So I can show you one basic thing. So we're gonna draw a face within a circle. A okay. face in a circle. Yeah. All right, done. Okay, so you have a face, right? Do you have a circle? I'm drawing. I'm already one. failing. Hold on, I'm already failing. Give me a second. Okay. Okay. All right, um, let me see where you are. <laughs> sorry, Edison. Uh, yours looks great, Edison. Um, Edison, uh, I, I said it. Sorry, I said. Laughing at me. I said it. I said it. Are, are teachers normally supposed to laugh at their subjects? Did you aren't, just break aren't out? Teacher, aren't the teachers supposed to be like, you know, guiding them respectfully? No, no, no. Yours is great. Yours is great. Yours is great. Um, yours is like a cloud. That, you know, cloud works too. Okay. No, mine is a bush. <laughs> For the Bush Nation. Are you laughing at my mascot? Oh, it's a bush. Okay, it's a bush. Okay, so perfect. You make a bush. You're still laughing. I can hear the laughter in what you're saying right now. I can hear the smile on your face. All right. I'd appreciate it if you didn't make fun of my entire community and all the hard work that I put into creating my stream all right. and brand so I'm over the last three years. <laughs> I'm really I'd sorry. really appreciate it if you just didn't just oh, like, Oh, no! You know, I leaked my old project! Uh, sorry, the hold on. White Walker project? <laughs> no, I was making an email yesterday <laughs> and I leaked it. Okay, so, anyways, um, Peter, um, so since you kind of yeah. you know how to do this stuff, how? No, I don't. I had a concussion. Remember? Okay. Well, then, um, then fine. Okay. The next lesson I'm no, going to no, teach what, you guys. What, what were you saying? What were you saying? What was the lesson? Sorry. <laughs> how would you say? How would you fill in like the face? You know, with like because it's on a transparent background so all we've done is like drawn a lot so like a circle or a bush or whatever in a line but you know if we just upload that to twitch it'll be like there's no you know you have to have like base for the, the inside so how would you recommend filling it in with the bucket okay yeah you could use a bucket um but there, no like an actual bucket 
Is there is there a bucket symbol on the left? Whoa! Uh, hey, if you if you hover over the things on the left, it actually tells you what it does. Yeah, paint bucket tool. Whoa! This is so cool. Eraser also, tool. Also, if you see a little arrow in the bottom right of the tool, that means that it could turn into other similar tools. Oh, really? I mean, obviously, I knew that. Obviously, <laughs> obviously, you knew the that. Teacher. Here. Yes. Duh. Cool. Like the most common one I use is the. Do you see in the top left? There's like something that looks kind of like a. It's like a like jagged shape if you click on that's like the your selection tool so there's like the lasso tool which is more freeform and then there's the polygonal where you like click and you point and click if that makes sense yes 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 okay so now that the, i need you guys to get to a point where it's a circle and then it's like a um or a whatever shape you want and then it's filled in with whatever base you want whatever color wait, and then wait, we're gonna wait. so is there a bucket um there is oh there's a bucket tool do you see it it's a picture of a bucket it might be under gradient do you see there's and you might have to change it um do you see the gradient tool or maybe um what, what's the gradient tool it looks like uh, a square that's a gradient oh, oh you have it you uh it's above your tear the teardrop one for you okay gradient tool right yeah so switch that to bucket Oh, I right click. Got it. Yes, okay, you got right it, click got on it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. And then you can fill in your bush. What? Oh, okay. Um, yeah, there must be a hole in my bush. Okay, one sec. Just fill in the bush. We're running a bit behind schedule, so I'm gonna need you guys to learn a bit quicker. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I am learning as fast as I can. Okay, uh, uh, one sec. Okay, eyedropper. I'm gonna use that. Okay, this is what I learned from paint. Um, which we don't know what that is. Okay, moving on. Well, I'm just gonna say it had like it has. It's like <laughs> one of these things. Like okay. I felt very limited by paint because I just like I would literally just use it to like take screenshots of stuff, and I couldn't really do anything with it. So I'm really excited about Photoshop because I mean, there's so many more options. It's like my creativity just gets completely. Like it's like a lock and a key, you know, like the lock to my creative freedom and the key is Photoshop. It's crazy. Perfect. <laughs> well, what are you laughing at? I'm, so I'm have you here. filled in the bush yet? I'm trying. I think there's a hole in my bush somewhere. Okay. What you could also do, what I did is I made a second layer underneath the whatever bush or circle and I just painted it in. I took the paintbrush and I used white and I just like filled in. It's like a, it's like a. It's like I was using color pencil and I just brushed it in. That's like a slower way. Okay, I understand what my problem was. Before I was doing it in the wrong layer. Yes, layers important. Yes, la this is where layers are important. There we go. You need I to got do it. Yes. I got it. Okay. I got it. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. All I'm right. Good. Okay. So after this, you will you'll do this on your own time. So let's learn how to resize this as if we wanted to make it an emote, right? So um. It's 500 by 500, but something you need to know is that emotes are 128 by 128. So if you want to make what you have an emote, you could. You would just go to File, Save As, and then um, it'll ask you uh, at the end. Hold on. Let me make sure I don't have any like weird, uh, like it doesn't leak anything. Okay, perfect. Okay, so um, when you're saving your file, uh, you just need to like, um, the important thing is that it's 128 by 128. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We need to resize the photo first. So you go to image and then you go to image size. Do you see that? Uh-huh. Yep. So type in 128 by 128 and make sure it says pixels. Not inches. Do you see that? Got it. Okay. okay. Do I hit okay now? Yeah. And did the whole thing like... Plunk. Did yep, it, it did. Plunk. Okay, perfect. And then when you're going to export, uh, save this as something, for example, um, you, you see the save as button and you go file, save as. Yep. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Name it, whatever, maybe Bush, and then save it as a PNG. A PNG is a transparent file. Got it. Okay, perfect. So that's how, and then you would literally go to your emotes and we can go over how to import that later. Okay. That's the lesson for now. Do I save it as large file size, medium file size, or smallest file size? I, I do largest. It's just maximum quality. I like make sure it's just the Got best. It. Okay. okay. Does it make sense? Yes. Okay. Yes, sir. Sensei, sir. Okay. You guys now have five minutes to use what I've taught you to make your own emote. Okay. And then you guys but are going... Did. No, you're going to put a face on it or give it something. I did put a face on it. Do an entirely new one. 
But I don't want a new one. I want this I'm one. I'm making a brand new one. Thank you, Peter. Edison? No! Oh, am I in trouble? You're... Oh, sorry. The phone that you use made... uh, am I in trouble? Oh, no, you're not in trouble. Am I in trouble? Yes, you're in trouble. What? Why am I in because trouble? Because you're... You just make a new one. Make f five minutes to make a new one. But I like this one. It's so cute. Okay, then reuse this one, but add something to it. Change it up. I'm okay. making a face. Okay, but not only do you guys have uh, five minutes to do this, you need to have it exported into your Twitch emotes in by the end of the five minutes and being used as an actual emote. What if emote. I don't have any emote slots left? You, you want then me you to will delete one of them emote? and upload this one temporarily. Sir, yes, ma'am. Sir, yes, sir. Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm do you know sorry. how to upload an emote, Edison? Maybe. Okay. It is in your dashboard on your Twitch channel. You go to settings, partner. Okay, and then under your partner settings, there is a thing that says emotes. You go to the emotes page and it allows you to literally drag and drop the file that you just saved in there, upload it, and then boom, you have an emote on your Twitch channel. You do have to name it everything. Okay, boom. So you guys have five minutes starting right now. Make an emote, give it a face, upload it to your Twitch channel, name it, and I better see those emotes in five minutes. Sir, yes, sir. All sir, right. yes, sir, yes, ma'am, sir, sir, yes, yes ma'am, sir, sir, ma'am, <laughs> sir, no. Meet back at 141 42. I'll give you an extra minute. Go! 141 42. Yes, sir. I'm going to do it too. Go, go, go. Work with your chats. Hit it. Okay. <clears throat> I have to make one too. Okay, okay, okay. So let's do this. And then maybe I'll make it really mad because that's how I'm feeling. So some angry emote. Fill this in. Yeah, man, a little bit more red, probably. Yeah. Set a timer for five minutes. <laughs> okay. Ooh, just like that one. That one's a good one. That one expresses my anger well. Okay, five minutes. Okay. All right, so angry. Angry. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, and then, and then there's some extra nonsense on the side we want to get rid of. So let's just erase it. There's probably more efficient ways to do this, but I kind of just do this and delete this goodbye. And then, uh oh. And then whenever I mess up, I just control Z. Oh gosh. And then it just undoes my last step. Okay. Perfect. Ooh, kind of good. Ooh. Uh oh. Okay. So here is that. And then. <laughs> This is what I got so far. <laughs> All right. And then let's do on top of this two eyes. Those are not good. Let's increase the hardness. Okay. Too, too hard. Too big. Okay. Bad. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> okay. Oh, that's kind of too cute, but it won't be cute when I add eyebrows. And the eyebrows can be coming out of the uh the head because they're so expressive you know that's pretty good okay yeah just like that okay but we don't want it too similar to that the, that one because that i mean that one isn't one of my favorite emotes for a reason so let's make it a little bit more what's the mouth on that one that one's just like this right oh, so good okay we'll do how about a smile? Oh, that just looks like the devil. <laughs> a tiny mouth, a tiny mouth like this. Oh, I know exactly what to do. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> He's so cute. He's mad. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay, how's that? That's pretty good. And we don't have to have it red. We can change it as well. I think if we go to like blending options here, we can just change the color. Oh, that one's just gray. What if we did like pink, angry pink, purple, blue, green, orange, green, alien. I think red is best. Okay, red is best. How about like super red? Angie purple. Oh, this isn't bad. Maybe Angie purple. What do you guys think? 
probably red. Okay, let's just do this. Perfect. Okay, now we got to do this. Angie. Okay. Oh, how do I? Oh, you know, you got to add some of those things. This thing, they always do this in like an anime where it's like, do you know what I'm talking about? It makes it like. These things. I can't do this one for some reason. My mouse won't do it. my hand can't do it if I had okay that's not bad okay and then it, I sh I kind of want to rotate it a bit just that bit eh, maybe bigger smaller okay so a, a really big test that I always do um is oh you, you can look at all your mess ups by um or you can look how it's gonna be on dark mode by uh, changing the last layer to like dark, right? So like here it's kind of scuffed. Like you can see where it's gonna look really bad. So then you go fix it. You have to take out all this stuff. Oh, I think this is gonna look bad though when I don't take it, when I do this. See, now it's like not filled in properly. Oh, come on! All right, don't worry. Nothing. I am done. How? What do you mean how? It's one, it's 141. You said you said be ready by 141. Okay, I'm I am ready. I'm ready as well. Do you have your email uploaded? Yep. Oh, no. Wait, uploaded. Oh shoot. I didn't do that. It's Sorry. okay. You have an extra 60 wow. seconds. Wow. Well, well, well. Look who was a star student before, Peter. True. I am I am I am terrible compared to you. I bow before your majesty. Yes, kiss my toes. Set, uh, set the brush to heart. Kiss my ring, ring pinky toe. You know, whatever. Let's just go with it. On okay. my left foot. Export. Oh, oh okay. Export, export, export. The timer's going. The timer's going. Export, export, export. Save as, save as. Foo's mad. Okay. By the Foo's way, mad. Hot, hot tip. There is. Hold on. Is it? Yeah. So there's a hotkey, Control Alt Shift S, which will bring up like the the save the save uh like it'll give you a save window and it'll let you like resize and stuff in the window. It's really helpful. Wait, wait, what is it? What is Control that? Control yeah? Alt Shift S. It'll open a uh, save for web option, which lets you like resize and stuff and like like give you different presets on uh, like like and types of files that you want to save as. I use this Which I was for, about uh, to teach you guys, but you know, yes. Th th yes. I, sorry, I skipped ahead. Sorry, yes. But thank you, thank you for, for sharing that. How does this work again? This is cool. Oh, it optimizes Whoa. it for you. I don't understand. So once it, once you, you just save it. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, I'm almost done with mine, and then we're all gonna present ours. Oh, okay. Wait, how are we going to present it? Like a, on a screen share on Discord? Huh? No, I mean, you guys should have them uploaded, right? Yeah. So we'll just show, look at each other's emotes in the, we'll just look at them in the chat and we'll see what we could have done better. Oh, okay. 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 Hold on. Hold on. Oh, this is so cute. Okay. All right, now is everyone's emotes ready for presentation? Sir, yes, yes ma'am, yes, sir. sir. All right, who would like to go first? Uh, L Leslie, you should go first since you are the instructor. No, I'll go last since I'm the instructor. Okay, All right, I'll go in. first, sir. All right. All right. What was your emote and um, yes, can we see it? Yes. Uh, so my emote was um, it was inspired by my good friend. Um, yeah. OK, so it was inspired. Right. And uh, I really wanted it to represent my love for avocado. And um, I was really going off of the seven layer bean dip. Okay, okay. So layer three, we wanted to include the avocado. All right. So <laughs> that's where I got the color from. OK, the shape itself is from obviously the great Bush Nation. OK, and the face. The face is the face that I think of when I think of you, Leslie. All right, so that's that was everything that went into this masterpiece. All right, so I present to you Bush Adobe. Bush Adobe, of, all yes, right. Yes, in honor of our, uh, our sponsor. Okay, I'm pulling up your chat right now. No, no, can't, can't my, 
Can't my uh, subs go to your chat and say it there? You don't have to pull up my chat, right? Well, I, I, I'm just pulling it up. Uh, Wait, aren't you a sub of mine? Uh, Are you not? <laughs> well, I don't know why my emote doesn't seem to be working, but I, I'm definitely a sub of yours. Don't you worry about uh, that. Huh. Okay. I'm not. I unsubbed. Oh. All right. Uh, Peter, do you see Edison's? Are you able to see Bush Adobe? Uh, I'm I'm waiting for a Bush a Bush Nationer to come to my chat and spam it. What I did is I opened up Edison's chat as well and I just like paused it on a part and I am looking at it now. <laughs> I'm gonna do that now. Wait, that's so cute. It's actually cute. I'm he's actually like a friendly. He's a friendly little fart. This is really cute, Edison. That's a cute emo. Yeah, I like Bush Adobe. Did you just call? My mascot, a friendly little fart, Peter. Yeah, what's wrong with the friendly little? No, it's cute. It, you actually did a good job with it. Like, um, like, um, Leslie. I, yeah. Leslie. Yeah. This is the exact same emote that you laughed at about ten minutes ago. Yeah, you made it better though. You. You burst out into laughter when you saw it. It's good. It's good, Peter. Do you have critique on on Edison's a Bush Adobe? Uh, honestly, the only thing I would comment on is that it looks like you used the paint bucket to fill the inside of it. Uh, you could, uh, avoid those, like, weird like, white inner glow by, uh, just using a separate layer underneath and filling it instead. But honestly, I think it gives it a lot of charm, and my critique's not even critique. It's just, it's yeah. like a suggestion more than anything. I agree. I, wow, that's actually genius. Put it on the bucket, the layer below, and then, uh... it, It's so you don't get that, you know, that, yeah, that white outline, in, in line. Ah, yeah, but okay. other than that, okay. the face, it shows a lot of expression. I really like it. Um, yeah, it's good. It's good. It looks like a little amoeba. It's, what's like, better, an amoeba or a fart? It's it's, uh, it's like an amoeba farted. And you created this little guy. And I really love that. All right, Peter. We are now. All right. Yes, let's get your presentation. Thank you uh, for this time. Uh, I had a lot of fun doing my project. I went ahead and used an emote that is spammed a lot. I made a rendition of an emote that spammed a lot in my chat because my chat likes to make fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> so I did PCP laugh. Yeah. Wow. Wait, this is so good, Peter. Wait, Peter, you don't even wear glasses anymore. Though. Edison, do you I, see I, I this? Still do. I, I do see it. I do see it. <laughs> <laughs> this is awesome. Um, Peter, can you oh, tell oh, us his about is, his is awesome? What about mine? Well, you're no, yeah, you're, yours, yours is really is good. Even better. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tell so, Peter. Actually, something I really love uh -huh. about yours is the eyebrow outline. Yeah. And like, there's so, like a shadow under the eyebrow. Yeah. So I noticed that uh, a lot of people like to like add more definition to the drawing by like make like filling it, having an outline color and using a different color for the fill, kind of like what Edison did for his amoeba part and uh yeah I, I just used a little bit of a darker uh, flesh tone for like some of the shadows on the skin that's it he literally you have sh eyebrow shadows i mean it's and i mean this is i have i'm gonna give this an a, a plus thanks oh, teacher oh, what about mine yours is uh uh like a b a b you got a b what? Woo! I think he deserves an A. A for amoeba. A for amoeba. You know what? Or let's F let's bump fart, it up. Let's whichever. bump it up. Okay. Leslie, see, this yeah. is going to be the first B I've ever gotten in my life. Okay, fine. A. You get an A. All right. This he is going to be the first A I've ever gotten in my life. Both of you get oh. A's. I was a terrible student. I'm just kidding. I've gotten plenty of B's before, guys. Okay. All right. So um, the next emote we are featuring is my emote. Now, uh, if you would just uh, either you have your chat put Foo's Mad in yours, or you can go to my chat, however, whichever way to see it, and you'll see it. Now, what do you guys think about my emote? Which one is it? Foo's Mad. It's how I, I decided to do a version of an emote of how I was feeling. Uh, how I'm feeling about teaching you guys. Uh, you feel mad teaching us? Yeah. It's pretty cute, huh? Uh, teacher, so I noticed that in the emote itself... Wait, this emote is adorable. It's great. It's I noticed that there's a little, um, the angry veins thing somewhere okay, on the I know, top, I'm, right? I know, I know you're going to point out how I messed up and how it's like a little smudgy at the top. Yeah, I, I, didn't need, I need to clean it up a bit. I No, I wasn't going to say anything about that at all. I was going to say oh. it's really cute. 
Oh, thanks. Yeah, I wasn't gonna comment on that either. I thought I gave it a lot of uh, personality. Like it was a really like an emote made by you. Yeah, but you can see where I messed up on the eraser part. No, I can't see anything. Okay, cool. Leslie, well, is there a reason why you feel mad <laughs> when it comes to talking with me and Peter? This can uh, we talk about your we, feelings? We here? only have a two-hour period, so I can't elaborate on that. But we would use up all the time. Good. We'd it's use up all the time. Bottle up your emotions. Sometimes we'll you talk need to get after it off of your the chest. sponsored segment. <laughs> oh, <laughs> all right, mom, so mom and dad are angry. <laughs> All right, everyone. Now, that's that. We've critiqued each other's. we presented, and that's lesson number one. Any questions? You guys did a great job. How does it feel making an emote? Honestly, it's really cool. I, I really enjoy making my own emotes. Like, a couple of my other emotes are made by me as well, and they, I made them all in Photoshop as well, so Woo! it makes it really easy. And Edison, how does it feel to make your very first emote? Um, very first emote? Isn't this the first one you've made by yourself? Ooh. No. You're saying you've made one before Bush Adobe. Yeah. No, you haven't. Have you made it yourself? Even I know he's made his own emote before, Leslie. Edison told me that he's never even imported a file into Adobe before today. But that doesn't mean you have to. I've been limited by my creativity because well, I haven't used Adobe before. Well, now after today, you're so, no longer limited. How does it feel? This is his first Adobe made emote. Oh, first Adobe. Yeah. Bush Adobe's in the chat. <laughs> All right. Our next lesson. All right. Lesson number two, please. Let's move on. Everyone, please turn your pages back to Adobe Photoshop and let me know once you're there. Uh, like open up a new file? Uh, Oh, no. Just open a Photoshop back up. Okay. So what's a page? I'm, I'm just open Photoshop again. Get back to where uh, we is were. Is like a page tab? Oh, yeah. I mean, you, you see on the top, it says like untitled stuff like uh you, you can see like tabs adobe works uh -huh. similarly to like uh like an in link browser it's like you can have tabs and work on different things at the same time if you click between them that's right i have so many tabs open i'm gonna close them without looking at them just in case just in case <laughs> oh all right God. i'm ready they're mostly just blank okay sir, i'm ready sir perfect i'm a ma'am all right congratulations on your first lesson let's move on to the second one did you just say i'm a man huh <laughs> I said, I <laughs> I heard I'm a man. That's, that's Leslie's pure shock tone, and I love Leslie. it. Leslie. <laughs> huh? I, uh, I said, I'm a ma'am, because you a man, it, you introduced would, me as Edison. I would as definitely be, Edison. I mean, I'd, be, I'd have to question things about myself, okay. but like, if I really think about it, I mean, Peter is pretty attractive. Edison, <laughs> shut up! Serious! Yeah. Thank Peter's you, thank you! Like, maybe, we are running you know, behind I, schedule! I could accept this. Oh, sorry, okay, go Okay, on. so... Okay, everybody. So um, the next lesson we're going to do is continue to make an emote. However, we're using a photo. And I asked you guys to grab a photo before the class started. So you guys all have some photo to yes, work with. Yes, that's right. I have a photo ready to work with. Yes, just in uh, case I'm something totally weird ready. pops yep. up in my saved folder, I'm going to change screens. Okay, perfect. So whatever photo it is, I would like for you guys to pull that up. I have a photo pulled up and you guys should have a photo pulled up. Uh, yes, uh, um, I definitely have a photo. Uh, uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, I, I want to say that this photo should be as like fit into a square as possible. Like if you have a group photo of like 17 people <laughs> from left to right, it's not going to make for a good emote. Ah, oh, by the way, if you have, if you want to make a perfect square without actually having to resize, but for cropping purposes, you could use the selection tool while holding down shift, you click and it'll make a perfect square every time. Holy! So you don't have to guess if it's a square or not. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes, exactly right. That was the next thing I was going to say. So does everyone have a photo? Uh, what? I will in one second. Okay, perfect. <laughs> like just the selection box. Sorry, Peter. I see your photo. And it is marvelous. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's what I was thinking. We have. <laughs> Where did you get this picture? <laughs> I will in one second. Um. Uh. Uh. It's okay, Edison. Take your time. You're new. I understand. So while Edison pulls up his photo, we are going to go over 
just the similar things we're going to be doing. So technically, if you had a square, this photo, right, we would know how to turn this exact picture into an emo already, right? Just resize it to 128 or however, and then drag that and upload it just like you did to the previous thing, right? Yep. Um, yes. Okay. Ah, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, perfect. Uh -huh. So what the goal is here is to take whatever the center of your photo is. Oh, what is yours, Edison? Uh, you mean like what on the photo is the center? Like, okay, I'm looking at yours. I'm pulling your screen up. Aw. Edison's is similar to mine. Is that Wait, what's yours? Sock. <laughs> what? We both picked pictures of our cat. And Edison and Peter picked a picture of Scara. We, <laughs> what? Just, picked a, we just picked a picture of our most precious things. I don't understand. <laughs> Peter, you picked Scara? Isn't that like the least surprising thing of 2021? It, it, it is actually not too surprising. All right. So in this tutorial, we are going to be taking this picture and turning it into an emote. So um, now what I'm, one of my favorite tools in this entire program is the lasso tool or the polygonal lasso tool or even the magnetic one. You guys see the tool that looks like a lasso? It looks like a... You know what I'm saying? Yes, yes, lasso. Yeah, you um, see Actually, it? Leslie, yeah. Leslie, one quick thing before we um, jump into the lasso tool. Uh, can you tell us about the like, like how accessible this is for students? Oh, yeah, absolutely. So Creative Cloud is, um, first of all, is uh, the Adobe Creative Cloud. It has an all apps plan that is 60% off for students at adobe.com slash students. Always. It is always 60% off. Um, and it is... Yeah, that's 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 that. I think that's pretty awesome. So you're telling me as a student, I have a discount on creativity. Correct. Yes, absolutely. Wow. Yes. All students. I kind, of, I kind of wish I was still a student then. You Jeez. have access to so many different Adobe Creative Cloud products with just a low price of, what was it, $19.99 a month? $19.99 a month. That's so low. That's so cheap. For what the entire Creative Cloud brings, it's the actually amazing. Cloud. It's it's actually crazy. Like that includes Photoshop, Premiere, After Effects, Lightroom. Wait, everything? Yes, the entire Creative Cloud. It's a subscription, but it's always 60% off for students and you get access to literally every program. So there are separate plans if you just want Photoshop or if you just want like a specific one, but like you get all of them. Wait, that's actually nuts. Yes. Because so, that actually could change your life. If you get good at Photoshop, it could literally change your entire life. Actual factual. That's insane. Okay. All right. Wow. Continuing on with our lesson. So, guys, everyone turn your tool to the lasso tool. Do you see it? To the lasso. Yes. yes. All right. Now, if you uh, Lassoed. make a quick, like, outline, you see how, like, if you just hold down the left click button, you can outline the your, your subject. Right? Sir, yes, ma'am. And if you were to cl right click on it once it's all in a little bunch, you would click select inverse and you can delete like the outside, <laughs> right? Correct. Edison, make you, a, you, you don't, you don't you have to be perfect. Your selection depending on, yes. You also, I want to add that you could, uh, with the lasso tool selected, you could either press, I think it's alt to subtract from your selection or shift to add to your selection. So Wait, let's say you alt? have something. Let's say you have something already selected, right? You could uh -huh. press uh, you could press Shift to add to that selection, or you could press uh, Alt to subtract from that selection, in case you like uh, messed up a little bit when when you were selecting your initial thing. Huge, super, yeah. Um, one quick question I have is how do I like stretch the photo? Like, if uh, I to press Control T. Yeah. If you're if you're talking about resizing the image, press Control T. Yeah. And then you resize and then shift to like tr more tr do like actual transformations. Mine's locked. I think I have the lock. Oh, I see. Is it okay, I'm not sure. Okay. So what do I do after I've made this selection? Locked. So what we're trying to do is, uh, I think what the professor is trying to do here is separate your selection from the background so that you have a transparent background as opposed to the entire image. Yes. Correct. Yes. So Edison, once it's selected, right click on that and click select inverse. So it now picks up everything except socks head. Okay. And then it. press a delete key. And a press the delete key. And is it now just like the outline of his? Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Do you see that? Okay. 
<laughs> Perfect. Okay. So now uh, press control, control Z, control Z, control Z until you get back to your original photo. I want to just show you one other thing you can do. Um, I like the polygonal lasso tool, which is like, it allows you to like, you'll, you'll pick it up really quickly. It like allows you to like pick up like, uh, how does it, it just like holds your place for you. It, it, it's more for like, oh, I yeah. see what you're saying. Okay, yeah, okay, yeah. Hold on. yeah. So you can do it that way. Um, and then you can also do it the magnetic way. And this one's like a smart tool. It like picks it up for you. Just drag it along the edges and it sort of like senses the edges and it's actually super cool. So there- yeah, I'll try the magnetic lasso tool. Okay. Yeah, so you do whichever one you want. Whoa, this one's crazy. Yeah, magnetic tools. It's actually like, it's like a wait, this is crazy. Yeah, it's smart, but sometimes it like doesn't listen to you. But like, wait, it, this one's crazy. Yeah, it gives you a, like a general, it gives you a general selection. Like it kind of knows what you're going for. And then you clean it up using the, uh, alt. the, wait. the, yeah, the alt and the shift. Wait, this one's crazy. Oh my God. Edison, so smart. before we move on, do you understand the whole cleaning up process that Peter was going over? Uh, now, I was helping you go over. Oh yeah, yeah. Mostly, that, since you were such a wonderful teacher. Thank yes, you. yes, 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 of course. No. Okay, so, so. Before you like delete the background, when you have the thing out, right? Say it's like not really perfect. If you hold alt and go go to the lasso tool and hold alt while you're working on it, it can, you can like edit it. You have to kind of just try it for yourself, but go to the lasso tool while it's in the dotted thing out and then like uh -huh. hold alt while you're doing all this and just clean up the edges. Like just cut into like, do you, do you see? Sorry, it's it's okay. Sorry, sorry. I'm just getting used to. That. I'm like right clicking and left clicking does different things. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna have to redo this. I'm, yeah. So I'm just, just do take your magnetic tool and redo what you just did and grab the whole thing, but don't delete the background yet or don't select the inverse yet. Just get to the part where Sock's head is in a dotted do -do 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 thing. Got it. Okay. On it. Yes. And once you're there, then tell me. How come I can't brighten? All right. Okay. I'm there. Okay. Now, uh, okay. Now, um, actually yours looks really good, but in, in, if you wanted to clean things up in yours, you would hold all, uh, go to the lasso tool while, okay. and then hold alt and just see what it does. Like see what holding alt while you like do, th uh, should I click on things? No, just like, um, hold alt and then like make a circle into socks head with your tool and just see how you can like edit into it. Make a circle into Sock's head. How do I describe this? Um, like, 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 uh, <laughs> um, uh, ha, I don't know how to describe it. Peter, how do you describe this? Sorry, I was uh, a little zoning out. What was that? Like, how, once, how do, like, how do you describe the cleaning up part? Like, I don't know how to describe how he cuts, okay, like, so into it. <laughs> Okay, so Edison, you have your uh, your selection already, right? You made the mm -hmm. selection. Yep. So there are parts of it where like you don't want it selected, right? Like you, mm -hmm. or it's like over selected. Yep. You could remove those parts by holding down Alt and using the lasso tool. That'll basically delete that part of the selection that you have off of it, just to clean it up. You know what I mean? Do I have to? Uh, so I have the current selection now. Should I be removing the whole background right now? Like selecting inverse and deleting it? Uh, no, not yet. On, give me a sec. Not yet. So basically, you want to, uh, if you inverse it, you're just selecting whatever, uh, yep. the opposite of what you have selected right now, right? Mm -hmm. So you just want to make sure that the selection itself is uh, uh, everything you want it to be. If there's any parts that you don't want selected, you would want to get rid of that, right? So you would get rid of that by using the, the subtraction lasso tool. Okay, subtraction lasso tool. So by which is which is, which is which by just holding down Alt while having Got the it. selection tool. So for example, if you like made a selection of a circle and then you subtracted a circle in the middle, it'll just it'll not select the the middle circle. If that makes sense. And if you inverse it, it selects everything but that circle that that okay. ring that you made. Okay, got it. Okay, I think I understand. Okay, got but it. yeah, that's like if you, you know, if we're cleaning things up. But for now, let's just like grab the outside or grab it, select inverse and delete that. And and then, and now we have just our subject. Woo! Our subject. Yes. Got it. Okay. And um, 
for some reason my photo is like locked i i don't know why but like when i try to control t to transform it it's like not letting me free form it it's locked uh -huh. like my picture of sock like usually you know you, you have your stuff and then i press control t right and then like i pull on the sides and it stretches it but it's like locked oh, hold me. down shift hold down shift oh All right, how's that guys oh -ho -ho! perfect perfect yes 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 does that work much better <laughs> oh my god this drawing that you chose is amazing what, what oh, the picture sorry oh. so the picture that you chose of socks is amazing <laughs> so it looks like me when i just woke up holy <laughs> so then so then now um you know if you guys want you can brighten up the photos um by going to you can change you know, color and stuff you go image adjustments um at the top you go to image get to adjustments brightness contrast you can mess around with the stuff to make it a little bit more visible um and stuff to the chat but once you have that done you can i mean this is kind of it you can add a lay uh you can add some stuff to it maybe outline it or put some text on it even if you wanted but you're kind of good you're you're good to go edison does it make sense yep makes sense okay so you guys have now five minutes to get this picture do whatever changes you want to it and upload it and we will present in five minutes go go okay good luck everybody thank you okay should i add some text I'm done. Some oh wait you uploaded it already peter um, oh, I'm about to upload right now. Okay, you guys have three minutes. Okay, should I add any text to this? Like, Lauren Ips. Oh, okay. I yeah, I was. I want to make it wide. I think wide is better. Okay, I think this is as wide as we're gonna go, though, right? Like this. How about this? This and it's just a wide emote. Oh, we could do a bonk thing. That's a great idea. Do we have a baseball bat? Oh, maybe not bonk. Yeah, bonk. <laughs> okay, okay. How do I get a baseball bat? Just Google baseball ball bat. Okay, and then... Okay, okay, perfect. I just Googled some baseball bat. Copy this image. Import it in. And then let's delete the edges. And then rotate it. <laughs> I don't know if this is right. Is this going to work? Because it's too... A hammer, a hammer. A hammer, let's get a hammer. A uh, hammer, hammer, hammer. A hammer. Oh, okay, not like a real hammer. <laughs> That's like messed up. Uh, <laughs> like a, like a, like a, like a, like a thick hammer, not like a real hammer. How do I get like a, a one of those like dun 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 hammers, you know what I'm talking about? Uh, like smash hammer, smash bro hammer. Mallet, it's called a mallet. Ah! Uh. I wish. Th oh, these are all. Uh, okay, this isn't bad. Okay. For our purpose. This one has uh, a Shutterstock logo on it. <sighs> Yoink. Oh, gosh. How do I get rid of the Shutterstock? Go away. <laughs> just, just for this purposes, okay? <laughs> Okay, so, oh god, <laughs> don't you worry, guys. We'll, um, we'll fix this all. Then we'll fix it. This is just a scuffed sped version, okay? If I had more time, you know, I could draw out my own hammer. It would, it would look a, a lot better and cleaner, okay? Trust me, it's because I'm on a time limit, okay? So bonk, okay, and then and then like this, and then bonk. That's pretty good, right? Is this illegal? <laughs> okay, you know what's not illegal? You know what's not illegal? I have an idea. I'll draw it myself. New layer. And it'll be a new la It'll be inspired by this, okay? Bonk. Perfect. <laughs> all right, all right. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, so then, and then... Okay, okay, that's a little scuffed. Let's try one more time, really fast. A little bit better. Okay, okay, so 
<laughs> a little ah oh <laughs> where's my project <laughs> okay so then <laughs> Perfect. This is my hammer. Now. I don't need you, Shutterstock. I have my own hammer. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, and now we make it like a brownish color. Something like that. Maybe like this. And then we just fill it in. New layer. Here we go. Like this. Hey, Leslie, what's the sizing that I have to have it? Like, width and height? 128 by 128, right, right. Okay, 120, yeah. Fill it in. Oh, 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 you know what I could do here? Go! Okay, perfect. Bonk! Okay, this is a little scuff, but I think this is good. Does that look good? This is the best we can do. Okay. Is that good? Okay. It looks like a hammer, right? It sort of looks like a pipe. Okay. All right. Whatever. It, it's okay. It, it is good. It's good. It's good. Okay. And then I'll go like this and I'll go. Uh, should I write bonk or I think it's good. Oh, oh okay. Okay. I'll fill in these lines. It looks a little scuffed. No, 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 no. No! Okay. Good. Bonk. Okay. Save as. And bonk.png. Okay. Okay. And then, uh, boom, boom. Okay, I'm almost ready. I'm almost ready. I just have to upload this now. Twitch.tv slash dashboard. Okay. Okay. I gave you guys some extra time, but you guys better be ready. Who, uh, you... I'm running into um, sizing issues. Sizing issues. Uh, okay. So are you, are you having trouble resizing the image? Let yeah, yeah. It's not letting me upload the image. So I've been spending the last like five minutes trying to... Okay, I think I got it though. Maybe. We'll see. If not, remember, control alt shift s will let you do the exact dimensions of your image. And then you could resize it. So do I have to change the image size to 128? 128, right? Oh, uh, 112. 112? I believe. Oh, yeah. it's 112. Isn't it 2856 and 112? Yeah, I think he's right. Yep, 112, yep. 112. Okay, let's try this. Peter, how's your progress? Uh, I'm done. I'm ready. Okay. I'm spamming. All right. I'm also ready. Sorry, people in Winry are like cuddling right now, and it's the cutest thing ever. They're like on stream. All right. I think I'm done. Okay. I think I'm ready. I think I, uh, all right. All right. All right. I think I'm good. Who would like to present their emote first? I'll go first this time. All right, Peter. Straight all A right. student. So my emote was dedicated to the most wonderful man in my life. Okay. His name is Scara. Twitch.tv slash Scara. S-C-A-R-R-A. All right. I'm pulling and up your I, emote I, now. I've been lacking a prey emote lately and uh, I have PCP prey. Oh, this is so good. Peter. Yeah, so for this one, I just did some very, very mild uh, effects. So, uh... You could actually apply effects to any layer in the bottom right. It literally says the word effects. And I I applied a outer glow layer to give him a kind of a shiny white glow. I gave him yellow at first, but it kind of looked like urine. So I changed wait, it back wait. to white. How did you do the outer glow layer? That's sick. Yeah. So when you click, on, click on the layer that you want to add the effect to. Do you see on the bottom right? Remember like where I told you how to do the add new layer tab? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So to the left of it, you'll see the letters FX. And there will okay. be a drop, it will be a drop down menu. Okay. And then from outer there, glow. You could, yeah, you could draw. You could add different things to it. How, wait, how do I add how that exact add outer, outer glow? glow? So I click on Effects, outer glow. Outer glow, and then uh, something will pop up. I, I just uh, change the color to white. Like it'll show in the top, in the top right. There's like a little square of which color. And then I changed my spread and the size. 
so that it looks more uh, diffuse and natural. You you see a preview in the right side of how the effect will look. Whoa. Okay. Wait. Spread in size. How did you do spread in size? Uh, the, the middle the middle area says elements, and that's where it says spread and size. And there's like a there's like a little meter thing that you could uh oh, move back and forth. Whoa. There's different blend modes, but I'm not actually I'm not really too familiar with blend modes because I'm self taught. So screen I I'm not 100 percent sure how it works, but I'm sure you'll be able to find some really useful tutorials online. Oh. Provided by Adobe. Whoa, this is cool. Yes. Whoa, I want to change. I want to upload this emo now. Well, you can edit. Yeah, you can do it right now. Edit it. Add a glow. Add a glow. Okay, add it a glow. Well, uh, okay. Well, we'll yes. go with the current uh, emote right now. That's yeah, fine. Yeah, we can. You can add. You can use these effects in our next lesson. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay, Excellent. Edison, you're going to be presenting next. Yes. So, uh, I wanted to combine the two things in my life that I love the most. Um, number one, sock. I love sock. Okay. Number two, French people. I love French people. So I present to you. Is it bush a sock? Bush sock. All right, let's see it. Okay, I don't know why I said French people. That doesn't. I, I guess it's just the mustache made me think of like French people. <laughs> it's like a. Wow, Edison. It's actually. Wait, this. Is, <laughs> it looks like a villain, and I love it. That's awesome. <laughs> it's so small though. <laughs> no, it's good. It's good. No, you did a good, good job. It's good. It's great. Bush That's sock. a great emote. I like it. Thanks, Peter. Thanks. Wow. Wee wee. <laughs> wee wee. Wee Maybe wee. I should have made it. Bush wee wee. No, no. Bush sock is good. All right. <laughs> um, any critiques? Uh, well, my critique would say you could clean up the ed edges a little bit. And some, uh, and like, I mean, that's if you go in with like the tool. Maybe you could use a little like eraser tool at the end to clean it up to make it look less. Uh, there's like, you know, how you could see like the background a bit. Um, but, you know, for, for just outlining it, it is perfect. And I like the, you drew some expressions on Tim. And also, yeah, I would, I, I would clean up the edges a bit. That's my big thing. Peter, any critique? No, pretty much everything that you already said, Teach. I, th I think you nailed it on the head. But I think overall, it's a great emo. And it really expresses the evilness that resides within Sock. Perfect. All right. Huh? Anyway. What? Uh, okay. All, right. All right, teacher. My emote is um, <laughs> sometimes Sock is a very bad boy. And he's really annoying. And all I want to do is take a little hammer Wesley! and bonk him on the head. But only, only figuratively, of course, I would never truly bonk him. So what? It's, so it's I... a, and and if it's a very small, it's a plastic. No, no, no. Yeah, I have her on. She's screaming right now. Yes. He was bonked. She wants to bonk her. Yes. <laughs> She's crazy. So do you see Fizz bonk? He's being bonked. <laughs> Bad sock bonk. <laughs> Bad socko. It's cute, right? Wait, uh, Lusty, this reminds me of what you did last night to sock. Oh, Edison. What? Edison. <laughs> and some might say it looks like a pipe. Uh, no, it doesn't. It looks like a hammer. Okay. It, wait, it actually totally does it look, look like a pipe. No, it <laughs> looks like a gavel. It looks like a gavel. What's it a looks gavel? Like a gavel. What's a gavel? Like a, what a judge uses to like uh, order wait, isn't in that the what court. It's supposed to be. It's order! supposed to be a gavel. Bonk. Yeah, so that's my emo and I um and that is all. And I think that now I've learned a lot, I would actually probably add a nice little actually I don't know if I'd add a glow to this one. Um maybe I would. But that's and that's that. I drew the hammer myself if you're wondering, like, no, I did not copy paste it from some website. Hello? Hello. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so perfect. All right. So I think we did a great job on the emotes we have from Peter. Uh, let's summarize. You did um, PCP Prey. What did you call them? PCP Prey. PCP Prey and... If you need, if you need and someone PCP a little Laugh. than than Jesus. Yes. And, oh, yes. I made PCP Laugh and PCP Prey. Those are my two emotes, and I'm very proud of them. They're really good, Peter. I honestly, like, you should keep them. No, I, I, I probably won't. Like, they're actually really good. I thought I, I actually am uh, happy with how PCP Laugh turned out. It's it, it so turned out better than I thought good. It would. I'm like no, but that's the thing though. Like, if you want to make your own emotes, like it's it's totally doable, and there's like tons of tutorials online. And with the student pricing, it makes it like 
Like it makes it totally realistic for Wait, you. Wait, how much is the your... pricing? Nineteen ninety nine a month for over twenty creative co uh, creative cloud products. Sixty dollars. I mean, sorry, sixty percent off for all students. Sixty. Wait, are you talking about the Creative Cloud, which has all of these different apps that let you stand out as a content creator? Absolutely. Just... Mm -hmm, oh my mm -hmm. God. All right, guys, we are um, he now going to move on to our final lesson. All right. Um, I our final project. We are exactly on time for this. I'm I, I'm so really? shook. Yeah. I scheduled for tutorial number three to start at 2.20 p.m. And it is 2.20 p.m. Well, you know about Twitch streamers. We're always on time. Yep, we always keep to a strict schedule. Absolutely. Exactly. We care about our viewers. exactly. Absolutely. We are we are professionals. Yep. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. yep. Now the final thing we're going to be we went over emotes, so now you guys are kind of experts on that. The last thing we're going to be doing is how to make our own panels underneath. You know, like oh yeah so like this is the big times now because the panel is huge yeah i mean a panel is much we bigger making. uh there's per you know people use it to just like hey check out my instagram check out this check out that so now uh we're going to take what we've learned and apply it on a little bit of a bigger scale so how to make a panel so Woo! let's go. Dun dun dun. dun. What are the dimensions? Yeah, the most I know important the width thing. Is the part, right? Yeah, yes. So the recommended size for Twitch panel is 320 by 160. 320 is the important part. It's just the width because a panel can go as long as possible as you want it. It can be a real yeah. So just it, but if a small one is 320 by 160 and so everybody go to make a file that's 320 by 160 and let me know when you're done. Pic 320 by 160. Pixels, All right. pixels, by the way pixels yeah or you can make it 320 by you can make it a square or whatever so um yeah all right 320 are you guys there now yes all right yes perfect. sir sir yes sir so what do we want to make uh we, we can make an, an ad for prime gaming your instagram scara's instagram whatever so <laughs> Honestly, anything you want. That felt like a very targeted comment, Leslie. No, you want to comment? If you, you wanna... if you wanted to, you could. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I actually got the perfect idea. Okay, really quickly. Um, there's a fun way to make text. Out of it, it like you know you could go to that big T and, and like type something, but you can also right click on it and switch the tool to horizontal type tap tap to that horizontal type. Um, you know, and then um, do you see that? Can you say that one more time? I'm sorry, I'm a very <laughs> slow listener. Ah, yes. Okay, so um, on the t the T in Photoshop, you can right click on it and change it from horizontal type tool to horizontal type mask tool. Oh my God. Yes, and then if you type in that form, it gives you like type something and then click out of it. Um, do you see that? Okay. Uh, do you see how it like is like an outline of the text? It's like a dotted outline of the text. Yep, yep, I see it. So you can like fill it however you want. Like you can take a brush and like now you're working within that space. Like within, it's kind of like you have a square, but you have like text now. So it's kind of cool because you can, whatever you do is like within that text shape. And then um, you can go to edit once you have that and you can go to stroke, edit stroke. And then you can like, uh, do stroke and then you can pick inside center or outside and like change and create like an outline okay, hold of on, that hold text on, hold, on, hold on sorry i was trying to do okay so well i need to back up so i did the horizontal type mask so i typed in some text mm -hmm. okay and then you're saying i can do stroke yes so i can stroke this yes correct so you go to edit stroke and then change the width of that and the color and then press okay and just see what happens Oh, okay. Do you see that? Yeah. Okay, so basically you can do what you can stroke with different colors. You can do the in, you can make the inside different colors. You can make the inside like uh, you can do whatever you want. You can make it like a candy cane, rainbow, whatever. You can take the gradient tool within this if you wanted. There's a tool that's um uh, where's the gradient tool? It's by the paint bucket one, and you can drag it and like change the gradient colors you're using. Uh, you can use rainbow colors. You can and you can and then you can like I can do rainbow colors. If you want, you can. Um, you can do whatever colors you want on the inside of your text. Anyway, so these are just like there's a billion like uh, techniques you can to like make your images better.
I, it'll take a long okay. time to go into all of them, but this is just one of them. Okay, I'll probably keep things pretty simple here. Yeah, okay. So, anyways, your next assignment is to take everything you have learned and to create a panel that advertises something. Okay. Yes. Um, this one's a little bit lot harder, so I'll give you guys 10 minutes to make any advertisement for anything have it uploaded to your panels and at the end we will go to your panel and we will look at it roger does anyone have Got questions it. uh yes i only have one question yes sir can you tell me what is going on we are making a panel no i mean uh the with this stream Oh, yes. We are today. We are sponsored by Adobe Creative Cloud to talk about the Creative Cloud All Apps Plan, which is always 60% off for students at adobe.com slash students. Creative Cloud has all the apps you need to stand out as a content creator on Twitch. The power of creativity is unleashed with Creative Cloud. Creative Cloud apps like Photoshop aren't just for designers or influencers. They're for anyone who wants to take their future into their own hands and stand out from the crowd. For all creators, no matter where you are in, the cre in your creative journey. All right, let's do this. All right, Peter, are you there? Yes. 10 minutes. Sorry. 10 minutes. Oh my God. Okay, yes. You have 10 okay. minutes to make. A... Okay, so reconvene at 2.35. Yes, at 2.35, you guys will meet and you will present your files. And yeah, you make an advertisement for anything that you want. All let's right, get... sounds good. Wait, so Photoshop. are we going to be oh. adding these to our stream? Yes. Oh, oh, also, do you guys know how to add a panel to your Twitch channel? Oh, add yes. a panel to your Twitch channel. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you know how to do yep. that. You just go to yep. your profile, like add the panel, up, uh, save it, upload up it. Twenty four seven, yo. You, okay, thank you. Okay, so yes. In okay. the six two six. Okay. Anyways, good luck and ten minutes. Make an advertisement. We'll meet back. I'm, I'm way ahead of you, Cam. Yeah. Sauce Confirm, Instagram. Sorry. Confirmed. Okay. You're, you're Leslie. You said I'm. Sorry, I was talking to my chat, but then I forgot to mute. I'm working oh. on something. Goodbye. What do you? Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. See you guys in 10 minutes. See you in 10 minutes. And just another reminder that. Oh. I, I'm late, but there should be in second now with Leslie screaming at Imud. Ha ha. I don't think I need a whole emote just for Sai. Kuno! I do I do it enough. It's, yeah, no need for an emote, Angie. Th Hello, Angie, though. Thank you for the $6. Mighty Savage Twitch Prime Sub. Buzz, thank you for Twitch Prime Sub. Casey, thank you for the three months. All right, let's do this. Um, I'm going to be making an advertisement for Socks Instagram. I'm already there. Okay, here we go. Um, so what I want to do is probably go to Socks Instagram first, okay? And I'm going to just screenshot, like, I want to show the people, like, what do you get by going to Sock's Instagram, right? So I'm going to, like, do this. Sorry if that was loud. Okay. I'm going to screenshot it. Copy this image. Um, and just a reminder, everybody, that this um, Adobe Creative Cloud is 60% off for all students. All students. So um, if you guys are a student, don't forget to take advantage of this opportunity. Okay, so first things first is let's um, copy this, save this image as socks Instagram, right? Um, let me open, let me open this. Okay. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, okay. So I'm going to make a square pan, or I could make a long one, right? Okay. So some. What about this? Or what if I just do this, right? And then be like, follow my cat. Hold on, let's make it a little bit like this. Okay, so there is that, okay? And then I could be like, follow my cat. Okay, boom, let's change the text. Make it a little bit um, smaller, first of all, like maybe 50, no, no, like 50. Oh, okay, okay, this text is a little weird though. Um, Okay, um, we're on the front page, guys. I'm pretty sure that's why. Okay, what if I just did this? Follow my cat. Or I could make it more artsy, like follow, like one per line. 
But then I'd be blocking everything. It should be like this. Follow my cat. Oh, boom. That's kind of, that's kind of good. Like that, right? And then, and then, oh no, that's, that's a disaster. Okay. So then let's make a new layer just for text so that I don't ruin the background every time I change something. So if I did like, or follow Socko, follow Socko. I think that's even better. Let's try that. Okay. Okay. Like this. Follow Sako. Boom. That's kind of cute, huh? Okay. And then we go like this. Oh, you know, here's a trick that I like to do is I take the opacity. Opacity is like how, you know, it, like this. You know, I make it thinner or like less transparent. I think it looks kind of pretty like this. Okay. And then I add a stroke to that. And then maybe I make it black like that. Oh, that's kind of good. Hi, Meredy. That's kind of good. Follow Sako. Maybe too thick. So let's do stroke. Let's do four, three, three. Boom. Like that. Ooh. Okay. And if, oh no, I did this all in the wrong layer. No, 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 no. Oops. Oops. Okay. New layer. Um, the reason why it's important to make a new layer is so that I can edit the follow Sako part without um, actually messing up the the the, uh, the Instagram behind it or the pictures behind it. Follow Sako and then stroke this. Okay, and then let's do that. Okay, so like now it allows me to take like this and I can make this part bigger right here. Or I can make this part bigger. Or I can rotate it like this. I can change it around do all the different effects to it follow Sako like that see that's pretty good huh and it only changes like if I hide this layer boom so this is all on a new layer follow Sako and then let's let's border the whole thing um, to make it look like cleaner I think so if I do a, a, I outline the square and then I like stroke from wallet like now it's like a white border that's kind of nice oh exclamation point i think you're right like like this should we why do they all have different dimensions what are you talking about what has different dimensions can we highlight socks eyes oh uh like i guess we could add like um i don't know how to like like oh we can sharpen his eyes so you can make his eyes look uh, well, he has eyes closed for most of them. And we can make them blue. <laughs> make him a white walker? Wait, wait, what do you mean you can't hear? Hello? Okay, is it good? This is pretty good. Okay, and then maybe I can make it a little bit more... Let me think. How can I make this a little bit more like... Um... Uh-oh. Maybe, uh, I feel like the inside's not wide enough. Maybe I'll do it again like this. One more. <gasps> or I could do rainbow on the inside. Like, hold on. I, let me find it. Greens, iridescent, pastels, neutral. How can I make this? <gasps> Look at this. What if I go like that? Boom. That's kind of pretty. Yeah. Hey, Leslie, what are the dimensions again? 1,600, the 800? Three. Th three. Three twenty by whatever tallness. You can make it three twenty by three twenty, three twenty by one sixty. Okay, just three twenty is important. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep. Got it. Okay. Now that I think that looks really good, and then I'm going to add a new layer, stroke, and then. What? 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 What's going on? What's going on? Uh. Uh. Well, what? What's this? Preview. Uh. Close that. Close this. Uh. Where's my? Where did my stuff go? Uh. Okay. 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 There we go. So then I'm gonna go stroke, and then let's do. Let's make it. Five. Ooh. Okay. Stroke, and then make it like. Okay. Actually, make it like seven, and then I'm gonna stroke and make it like three, and then make this black. And like that. Boom! Follow Sokka!
taco. Yep, and then I'll take the Instagram logo so that they know what it, like, follow him on what, right? And then I'll just copy that, import it here. Jeez, that's ginormous. Okay, resize this. Okay, don't worry, I'll fix this. Delete all this part. Okay, so now we just have the... Oh, no. Delete that. Okay, oh, it's a bit scuffed. Whatever. Okay, no one will be able to see it. And then, what do we do with this? Oh, no. Here, follow Sako, and then add it at the end. Yeah, and then and then I can do this. Let me move this over to center. Uh oh, let me move this part over to make room for the Instagram logo right here, like that. Right, and then something like that, and then I can even I can even add a glow like Peter taught us to this thing. Uh, outer outer glow maybe something. Uh to to the to the Instagram part maybe a little brighter uh, a little uh, to spread like uh, oh okay something like that okay and then maybe even add a little glow to this part um add blending options outer glow oh not too oh I mean it's not bad on all of it even Okay. Looks kind of good. Yeah! Make the Instagram low. Oh, you want this as like the O? Socko. Oh, creative! No, his at is Sock the Munchie. I didn't even add it. Is this better? Sock, just maybe like that. Follow Sock. Looks good. How about just this and then I add his at at the bottom No, but you know guys guys here's the thing this whole thing is gonna link to his Instagram So if I go like I go like at sock the munchie I could do this really small actually I wouldn't mind this if I did like 20 How about that and then I do this at the bottom How about this Kind of cute, and then I just like make it black. What this? Ah, ah, that looks scuffed. How do I fix that? In a vicious cycle. Okay, sock the munchie like this. Staring at your silhouette. How about this? Lower the opacity of it. Okay, okay. Okay, hold on. I can do that. Let me do this here. Change the opacity over here. Oh, it looks like a watermark. I kind of dig it. It's not bad, right? Follow Sako. The feeling so different now. You got me floating here, a feather in the air. All right, done. Export, save as. Follow Sako, Insta. I'm spinning in a vicious cycle. Okay, so to add something to your panels, it's really easy. You just go to your profile, then you go to panels, you go to edit panels, and then you just click on add panels, and then, yeah, it's very, very simple. You just press the giant plus sign, add, and then, um, uh oh. Okay, remove this. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Okay, done. Uh, sure, remove that one. Okay, it links to Instagram.com slash Sock the Munchie. Okay, and then I'm going to move this to the top of my Instagram page or to the top of my panels. Okay. <laughs> okay, chat, can you guys tell me if you see it? Oh, shoot. I didn't add HTTPS. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The link is wrong. Okay. 
Does it work? Yes, it works. It works. It works. It works. It works. Ah, it works. It works. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, it's so cute. Okay, 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 okay. It works. It works. It works. It works. Okay. Already. Progress reports. Uh, All done. I am not even close to done. Um, okay. Um, okay, that's fine. Do you need any help? Uh, perhaps. Um. Okay. I, no, I, I need lots of help, but I'm I'm just trying to figure out all the tools. Um. Okay, the tools. Okay, sure. Um. Okay, like any questions, like that we could help you with. How do I select part of an image, and move the whole thing? I'm trying to use the marquee tool. Is that the right tool? Marquee tool. The rectangular marquee tool. I'm trying to move the whole image yes. down. Y yeah. Uh. Let me let me go to your stream. Okay. Just select it. Edison. Oh, control T, maybe control T. Okay, so what are you? Oh, could, I found it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I got it. Okay. Okay, got it. Okay. Yep, got it. Got okay. it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. It. Cool. 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 All right. Um, check back within in two minutes. Two minutes. Oh dear. Okay. You are okay. Yes. Okay. Two I'm minutes. ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay. I'm not ready, but I'm. I'll be ready in two minutes. How yep, does yep, my yep, link yep, yep. not work? My link works. I. I'm on my own page. Click on it. I clicked it. It, it should work. It should work. You guys should see this. See, this is my panels right now. If I click it, it takes you to my it sucks Instagram like that. Boom. It works. It works. Okay. So I'm done. Yay. That's so cute. I actually probably going to keep that. That's so cute. Fall is Sacco. That is so cute. I think it'd be so cute if you make the O's the two color of his eyes. You are a freaking genius. I'm going to do that real quick. Okay. Let's do that. The O should be blue and brown. Okay, so how do we do that? Um, what can we do? Uh, uh, I guess without going back a million steps, we could kind of cheat and just select only the the text layer and do this, right? Like pick this one and make this blue. It's kind of already blue, but we can like make it stand out like blue. Okay, maybe that's like too blue. Maybe like a little closer to his eye color, like that blue. Maybe a little more on the greenish side here. Okay. Okay, this could work up, uh, work, up, work. Okay, and then this one will be brown. It might look ugly to like the untrained eye, but once you realize what it does, it's like beautiful. Okay, and then this one will be brown. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Okay, yeah, yeah, I like it. And it's like, boom, boom. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, maybe I could add little pink ears. Okay, this might be creepy, but if I add like a little ear up here and a little ear up here. Okay, so you take the cloning stamp, cloning brush, you clone this ear and you put it here. Oh wait, clone this, uh, clone this ear. Can I do this and then put it on top of this? Okay, uh, th you know, some ideas are just better left. Okay, so save that. <laughs> let's just import, um, let's just, uh, <laughs> Uh, okay, PNG, save this one. And Leslie, if I tweet out about the emotes I made, do I? Do you think I need to add a FCC uh, thing? Uh, no. I mean, well, uh, no, I don't think so. Cause I mean, that's just like, uh, it's like your own thing. I mean, as, yeah, you, you I did, you like did the required tweet. To tweet it out. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you did your required tweet. You don't need to do that as long as this, cool. yeah, you did your own thing. I think. I mean, maybe double check. But just, okay, I don't want you to get in trouble. But I'm almost positive it's just like as if you made whatever. <laughs> the FCC is gonna be gonna be down my throat, man. Uh, I just, just in case, but I'm pretty sure you're good. So you did your required tweet. Okay. All right. All right. This is okay. Okay. Yep. Uh, um. Oh my God. This is the most embarrassing thing that I've done in a long time. Okay done okay is everyone ready to present and what? i'm ready to present so wait okay so for the panel do i need to have something does it need to should it have a transparent background or should it have something else what uh, uh usually a transparent background usually transparent okay yeah it can be whatever though okay got it okay uh, i'm not ready yet i'll be ready soon okay okay that's fine It's so cute! It's so cute! Blue and brown! Genius, genius, genius! Isn't that cute? 
Your face cam's kind of scuffed right now. Wait, what do you mean? Isn't it? Wait, what's scuffed about it? Is it just my face? It fits with the layout. Yeah, it's so cute. I'm so happy. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, I left for a moment. Why is the O brown? Because his eyes. We did an O. Like, oh, genius. One O to match his left eye and one O to match his right eye. It's like blue and brown because he has two different colored eyes, if you can see. And then it's like boom, boom. Ah, I love it. Okay. The border? Wait, what do you mean the border? The border? Oh, the face cam frame. Oh, yeah. Th this is a bit scuffed. I see what you're saying. Okay, we can fix this in the meantime. Okay. Like this. We'll do this. Oh, oh. I recognize this immediately. I don't know if I'm allowed to use this music. Even though I totally wish I could. Just... Yeah. I, yeah. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, how about this? Okay. All right. So let's do... Eh, I mean, that's kind of fixed. Let's just do this. All right. And your time is up in 10, 9. Edison, almost ready? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Ready? Yep. Done. Okay. Uh, okay would I'm you, good. Would you like to present first? I'm good. Wait, it says something went wrong. Please what do you try mean? Again. Uh, in, eh? in where did it go wrong? We can help. Oh, oh, I see, I see. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay. Please work, please work, please work, please work. Okay, it worked. I'm good. Okay. I'm good. All right. Um, Edison, you'll go first then. One, your panel's uploaded? Uh, yep. Okay, so we're yep. going to your... We're visiting your stream. Okay. okay yep. And we're scrolling yep. down to your panels. Yep. All right. <laughs> All right, Peter, are you there? Yes. Sorry, I was just clarifying something, but yes, I'm here. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, do you see Edison's panel? Let me see. Let me re refresh. No, I don't see it. It's not loading for me. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Let me try it again. Uh, uh, it yeah, it's just it's just not working. Oh, know. that's uh, that's a shame. It's okay, I, Peter. It's okay. Yeah, don't I think worry it's about like it. a I think it's like a internet related issue. I don't know. It's, it must be. It just yeah. Says, it just says, "I hate you, Edison." I don't know. It's weird. I, I don't understand what it's saying. Oh uh, no, no, no! Oh, it's, it should okay. be like a photo yeah. of you, no, kind of no, like I don't, I don't, I don't, uh, they're wearing kind of like a yeah, Christmas I, I, apron, I, I, yeah, horizontal yeah, I, I, down, yeah, nose, and like down to clown. No, it's just not loading. Okay. Yeah. So like that's like. If you click on it, it takes you to your Instagram. You know, not a big deal. Uh, yeah, but, uh, I mean, I would click on it if there was anything to click on, but it's just, uh, it's just not loading for, sure, for me. For sure, for sure. So. Okay, well. I see. Okay, okay. I All can right. see it, Edison. And um, well done. I mean, it fits in the panel. I have small critiques. Uh, the outline itself is a little bit scuffed, but like it's, I like it. Um, there's a small uh -huh. like white speck you like left on the f image on the right that needs some cleaning up. Wait, uh, what? Really? Yeah, like on the right side, if you scroll, you see there's like a white little dot that you didn't like clean up properly huh, also hafu uh -huh. rated you wait ha, why oh okay uh okay go on yes and then uh and then and so yeah i mean other than that i give it a b yeah you're a b, Yay, b. Let's do it. Let's go. not bad yeah i mean you have the idea you just like make a panel of whatever you want using photoshop it's cool all right peter you're the next all present. right to peter I, okay, so me and Edison had similar ideas, like the similar, oh! like similar vein of ideas. Okay. So, uh huh. All right, going to Peter's channel right now. Um, I'm excited. That's sick. All right, dude. All right. Uh, hello. Uh, Peter. <coughs> yes. P would you yes. like to so present I, I, yours? I, I, uh, yes, I made a panel dedicated to Scara. Uh, I used the very famous uh, Minecraft uh, font that you could find on the internet. And I, uh, yeah, if you click on the link, you go straight to his channel page. And I'm testing it out and it works. Wait, Peter, you made this in the last 15 minutes? Yeah. What is wrong with you? How are you so good at this? Well, this is actually... Did it's not it's not hard it's not hard you just compile what? the image together the it took me together. so long to do the thing that the, the just make the the <laughs> sideways picture of you it took me 10 minutes to figure out how to rotate it properly and then well, size it properly learn how to rotate it properly for next time it'll be much faster peter's been doing photoshop since he was in high school edison that's a long time Peter, long can I commission you to time make ago for me? 
Yeah, do, do, sure. Are your commissions are your commissions open? Uh, you know what? Not usually, but for you, never. What? Huh? Uh, usually, yeah. I was <laughs> anyway, say Leslie. You always... Anyway, Leslie, do you want to do you want to go ahead and? Sure. Uh... Yeah. All right. And then if you go on over to my panels, um, you can see that I have a panel. Okay. Is and in mine is a promotion for my cat Saka. And oh, this is great. The follow Sako. Yeah, and do you see the O's in his the Sako are blue and brown to represent his Boy, two eyes. That's so clever. Pretty cute. Okay. I bet you can make like the bottom of the C and the K like look sort of like his his mouth too, if you oh, wanted. Oh, like a little nose and like have yeah. some whiskers pop out. Yeah, I bet you could you could work something out where it would work like that. That this is great. Thank you. So uh, I just took a screenshot of his Instagram and then you yeah, add a little border, add some font thing, add a little tag, and it does link to his Instagram where you can follow I see that. my cat. Yep. Wait, have, did you just post these three pictures in the last twenty four hours? Yeah, his Instagram is popping. Have you thought? Have you thought about maybe updating his uh, his profile photo? Oh, yeah, that's like his baby photo. No, baby I kind of like that, though. I kind of like that it's his baby photo. It's cute. It's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. We love him. I miss him. Sako. He where, is he? where is he right now? Sako, oh, he's sleeping on the printer. Can you, Wait, can Sako's going to have more followers he? than me pretty soon. I could already feel it. And, uh, Wait, how many followers do you have on Instagram? I'm like 140 or something. 140? Sako's not even close to that, Peter. He, no, he, but the pace, man. The pace. Peter. Edison's all about the pace. Peter, the pace. I literally, I literally just pace. created I just created a stream panel just for you that links to your Instagram. And it says down to clown. I know you didn't see it, but it says down to clown. And it has a, an amazing picture of you. There is no way that this does not attract a ton of followers. There's no way, Peter. Dude, you're so lucky to have me as a friend. You're welcome. I, I, am, I am actually so lucky to have you as a friend. You're That's so true. welcome, Peter. Thank you, you smell Edison. like yeah. poopy. Oh, he sock is so cute though. Wait, are you oh playing with sock right now? No, I gave him a bath this morning because he has a smelly butt. Okay, so let's close up our our sponsor segment, everybody. Oh, it's already two fifty one. I know. We actually, I want to give props because I literally thought we were gonna be so much faster and that we'd have to put like six lessons. But luckily, you guys like take. Oh, took, yeah, we uh, suck. You guys so took a lot longer. We, we took so long. And it actually was perfectly timed. So, um, good job on that, <laughs> on taking. All right. Yes. Let's go. So, um, uh, let's just go around and say maybe some things that we learned or something we like about Photoshop or yes. All right. Hit it. Edison. All right. I like Photoshop and creativity. But did you learn anything today? Uh, I learned a lot. Actually. I learned a lot. I honestly, I didn't know anything about Photoshop coming into this stream. Um, and in this session, I'll, all I knew is that Photoshop was something that like people use to create really cool stuff, but I've never opened it before. I had to download it. I actually downloaded it like four hours ago. No joke, guys. Yes, um, you did. I, I really did four hours ago. And uh, like in the two hours that we've been working with it, I can see a lot of potential. Uh, it's just there's so many different tools and there's so much depth to it that it's like a little bit overwhelming at first. So I feel like um if there was better ways to like intro people to it it would be really really cool i'm sure there are I'm there, sure are, there, are, I'm sure there are. are yeah so, are. so i actually use the a lot of the tutorials on youtube i think it's on youtube like i remember just googling a lot of tutorials and then adobe actually provides a lot of really straightforward tutorials on how to there use uh, all their all their all their like yeah, yeah. all their programs so yes. it's really really helpful yeah and not everyone's gonna have great sensei uh foosley around to, to teach them True. how to like, show the ropes you know but honestly, like I had a lot of fun and uh, there are a couple little things that like I really like this this glow effect. Like the second you showed it to me, I wanted to add it to everything. And it just seems like this is like a little treasure trove of a bunch of different effects that you can add to whatever you want. And it's like, well, if I like this after trying it once, like how many more things are there that I would like that I could try? You can know? I show you guys so one last like really cool effect? Really cool stuff to, to play yeah, around with. Agreed. And I just have no idea what they are right now. So it's, it's kind of crazy. Can I show yeah, you guys overall, one last cool effect? Yes, okay. yes, show us. Leslie. Okay. Can I open, do I yeah. open your stream? Oh, yeah, open my stream so I can show okay. you the... Uh, okay. I have the photo. Okay, so, uh-oh. Uh, uh-oh. Uh, uh-oh. Oh, 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 nothing. Off. Okay, okay, let are me show you. you okay. No, no, no. Okay, so I have a stock photo here or something. Okay, right? So there's a really cool effect really fast that you... um, If you have, like, someone standing in the background of your photo, you can, like, pick them out and you can... um you can you can use this thing called fill it's a fill tool 
Um, and what you do with a fill tool is sometimes you can like, you know, use like you can you can change it to like the color of one of your colors or you can use their this shows you how smart Photoshop is. You can use this thing called content aware fill and it does its best to try and figure out what the background of the photo is and then it like fills the photo so it does it's not perfect but if you have like a really busy yeah. photo and there's just like people in there it like fills in the background for you whoa you can, yeah so but you clean it up obviously but like or you can like outline it and delete it at different places but it like gets rid of like things like people walking by like if you have a group photo it like actually is crazy i've used it a bunch when i have like a group photo and there's just like people walking by you just like delete them and like you can clean right, it up a bit awesome. yeah it's one of my favorite things it's like photoshop is so smart it just deletes people and like creates a fake ba background based on the like other people other in like things it just cues and yeah like creates lines of hills Wait, and that's stuff actually so Leslie, crazy yeah I, I wanted to actually show you one of my favorite effects oh. here if you want to open yeah, it yeah 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 yeah, yeah 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 like okay. one of my favorites and you'll love it too okay 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 uh hold so on. i want to teach you guys how to make your very own pog o Okay. Okay. So okay. Okay. Open up any image of your choice. In my case, I chose Grand Sensei Foosley. Oh okay. gosh. You okay. You go to filter here. Yeah. You go yeah. To yeah. Filter. You click liquify. Liqu. Oh God. Help. After you <laughs> click liquify, you go down to the blue. Wait. Are you tool. about to liquify my finance? If you're no, look, no, no, you're no, gonna no. liquify. You're about to so liquefy no, no, my no, finance. No, 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 you no, are, no, no. you I, are. I'm using something called the bloat tool. So you just bloat. grab the bloat tool. Okay. You increase the size of the the brush itself. I use brackets as the short, and you just pog o. Okay. And look at that pog o go. <laughs> In you, my can face. As, you can be as <laughs> Pogo as you want. So make your own Pogo. So okay. yes, with the powers of Adobe and Photoshop, you can be your very <laughs> own Pogo as well. Can you Either. send that to me and I'll upload it as an emote? Yes, I got you. Yep, just that. I'll just screenshot that. Actually, Either you know what? I... Hold on. I can do it right now. I'm doing it. Go ahead, Edison. Well, no, no. Never mind. Never mind. I'm good. Nothing. I'm good. I'm yep, just admiring P Peter's creative and... Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, freedom to do whatever he wants. Yep. I am making this Pogo into an emo as we speak. After everything we've learned today, yes. All right, I'm almost done. It is being almost uploaded. Oh, this is gonna be so scuffed. Okay. Um. All right. So yeah. Thanks for teaching us, Great Sensei Foosley. Would you like to go over all of the, um, uh, all the great things about Creative Cloud and their student discount again? Uh, me? Oh yeah, I'd love to. I mean, oh, like, what more is there to say? The fact that there is, like you said, there's a student discount. It's sixty percent off for all students. All you have to do is go to Adobe.com/students, and it has all the different apps that you can um, use and learn from. Um, I mean. One of the coolest parts about being a student is the fact that you're like given all these different options to, to learn from and grow from and uh, where you want to take your life, you know, and, and if any of that requires um, one of the strongest and best tools and creative suites on the face of the earth and and you get 60 percent off on that, you know, that's kind of crazy. I definitely check it out. Absolutely. Um, uh, Creative mm -hmm. Cloud has all the apps you guys need to stand as a content creator on Twitch. The power of creativity is unleashed with creative cloud and creative cloud True. apps like photoshop are not just for designers or influencers they are for anyone who wants to take their future into their own hands and stand out from the crowd they are for True. all creators no matter where you are in your creative journey yeah whether you're just starting out or you know like me or you've been using photoshop for the last 10 years like peter True. actual and factual <laughs> so i can't stop laughing at it. it's just looking back at me what <laughs> What, what are you laughing at? Peter, are you okay? Foos Pago. I'm sorry. Go ahead. And I have officially uploaded Foos Pago as so I actually had three extra emote slots and now they are filled with Foos Mad, Foos Bonk, and Foos Pago. And they're just perfect and I love them very much. Alright, I'm gonna tweet this one out too. <laughs> okay, the cropping is 
All right, thank you, Leslie, for the All right, wonderful lesson on uh, teaching us how to use Adobe Creative Cloud, specifically Photoshop. That yes. was great. Yes, and big shout out to my students, Peter Park TV and Edison Park Live for for being so uh, patient with uh, me. And uh, yes, you guys are great. Thank you for being patient with us. We are we are some horrible students. Factual and actual. Thank you, guys. Factual and actual. Give over and out. Over and out. Roger and Dodger. Out. Roger Dodger. Bye, guys. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, wait, what do we? Oh, wait, are we oh. done with the segment yet? Or I'm, oh, well, we, we still well, have another minute. Well, oh, yeah. Well, I was going to go over just, my own personal yeah, stuff, too. Yeah, yeah, close, oh, close right. it out okay. yourself. Bye. Okay. Cool. Bye. All right, cool. Uh, um. All right, guys, don't forget that you guys can also type exclamation point Adobe in the chat if you want a link to download Creative Cloud yourself. It is $19.99 for students, uh, and that's, yeah, it's a really good deal. You guys get way more than just Photoshop. Premiere Pro, After Effects, Lightroom are just some of the other ones. I'm sure you guys have heard of them. They are, like, insanely, uh, there's, there's a learning curve, but, like, um, it is, these are tools that are so useful once you dive in and you guys can see that even if you don't have all the time you can learn basic things like making emotes resizing things making panels you don't have to commission people to make them all for you you can do it yourself all right that's it thank you so much adobe for sponsoring the stream and that's it goodbye we did it wahoo i think that's it right Oh, we'll be right back right after the stream. Sorry, uh, we'll be back very shortly. Uh, 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 one second, one second, one second, one second. Thank you. And we'll be right back. I'm actually not sure how long to leave this one on, but I'm going to pee. So, so, so be back right after this. Testing. I've decided that we're going to host Edison and then whatever he wants to do. If he wants to play Valo and stuff, I'll play it off stream. Okay. So we're going to send you guys over to finance. He's streaming, right? I think he's doing like a life update or something. So yeah, I'm going to see if he wants to play Valo or if he just wants to chill. I'll just watch the stream. Okay. All right. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. Thank you to Adobe. This is actually a super fun sponsor. Like, uh, it, it, it was, I guess, it was Peter and Edison, the fact that it's Adobe. It was just a really fun one. Okay, so raid Edison stream. Say hey, oh, potato to him. And um, I'm going to be hanging out in his chat. Thank you guys so much. Um, usually I don't stream on Fridays, so um, I didn't really have anything planned. Um, I was going to play Bella, but maybe if he wants to, I'll just be chilling and seeing, uh, watching his stream. Thank you guys, chat. You guys are wonderful, amazing, and I appreciate it. And I'm just going to drink my coffee and clean my house and clean my room because I'm a mess and I would think I have bed bugs. So I am doomed. Yeah, guys, I actually think I, I, I haven't found bed bugs, but I have these bites that are in like these really weird patterns that make me think that I have them. So I'm just like, yeah, I, I'm kind of freaking out. So, um, you know, I can't find any, but apparently they're like super good at hiding if they if they if you do have them. So in any case, um, I think I'm getting an exterminator to come. And yeah, so anyways, sorry. Stress bites. 
I have a whole, like, a, they're in clusters. Like, what? I'm oversharing. Goodbye. Goodbye. You heard nothing. Nope. Goodbye. See ya. Goodbye. I'm burning the house down. That's all you need to know. Burning it.